I become a little too shy for love. I've been hurt before, all's fair in love and war. So I snuggle up close to the shell I'm living in. And if I let you in, another round begins.
My mic is muted. <laughs> Am I stupid? I guys. All right, listen, 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 listen. <laughs> All it took is some money to get me to realize. <laughs> My mic is muted. <laughs> also, also, I don't know if he's here. If you're here, dude, put it in chat. But IGP started calling me. I'm assuming he started calling me, not on Discord. I'm assuming he started calling me because he happened to pop in and he ripped. Eh, how is, don't say it's still muted. No way. No way is it still muted. No, it's not. It says the little waveform things. Don't, don't do that to me. Don't do that to me. <laughs> all right, you know what? Cut, we're doing it all over again. All right, back up. We're doing it again. We're doing it again. All right, fuck, man. All right, listen. What happened was, I said that I was gonna stream tonight at 9 p.m. and do Alan Wake, but I forgot that I have a hockey game to go to with the family. I forgot that we had tickets to a hockey game and that we had plans tonight. And I almost didn't stream today. I almost canceled. And I was like, nah, you know what? It's Christmas. I owe everybody a Christmas present. So we have to, I have to stream. And I really wanted to play more Dave the Diver because we didn't get to the Dredge DLC. So that's what we're gonna do today. Also, I did, listen, I know I started unprepared with the mic muted, but I have, I did my research. So we need four things to happen for the Dredge DLC to pop. We need to be in chapter six, which we are. You need to have it downloaded, of course, which I double checked and I did. You need to have the chicken farm unlocked, which I'm pretty sure we have the chicken farm unlocked, but we'll double check that. And it needs to be a thick fog at nighttime. So last night when we were playing Dave the Diver, it was like rainy every night. So we haven't encountered the thick, thick fog. Blah, blah. Somebody say that five times fast. What the fuck, dude? Thick fog. And look, every day is storming. Where's my fog at, man? 1027 storm, 1028 storm, 1029 storm. I need fog, baby. I need thick fog to be able to start the dredge shit. All right, we're gonna get there. We're gonna get through these days. All right, anyway, I was also saying my voice is a little bit better because I did some stuff to take care of it last night. So hopefully it holds up. I feel, eh, eh, I feel all right. 
I, uh, I, I'm hopped up on a bunch of cold medicine and Mountain Dew. I know I held the can up earlier, but you guys didn't know what the fuck I was saying. So, anyway, Carrie, thank you for the $10 euro donation. I think that works out. Oh, oh, it tells me my stream elements now converts different currency to USD. So that works out to 12. That's actually more in my currency, USD. It's $12.56. Gary, thank you so much for the super chat. Really appreciate it. <laughs> you legend for letting me know that I'm a complete idiot. I Thank you. You rock as always, Gary. Paolo with the 10 gifted channel memberships. Paolo, you legends. There's, there's two. Hold on. We, I got to start playing the game. Mojo Monk, Travis Liming, Tara... Black Panda, Nine Inch Colas, Shorty, who else? Gypsy Girl, Bones, uh, Miss Norwood, Ryan C, all became channel members on behalf of Paulo and probably some people that I missed. So, but welcome everybody. Paulo, Hannah, thanks for being here. I appreciate it. I know this is like super short notice. So, and uh, Carrie. Travis, welcome, welcome everybody. Panthera, Nine Inch Colas, good to see all of you. I'm sure I've missed people. All right, it's nighttime. Let's go back to the restaurant. We need another cookie. We need eggs and stuff. Can I not go to the farm at night? I can't. Oh, we don't. I don't have the chicken farm. Do I not have the chicken farm? Let's do the restaurant. We need to make money. So we need to unlock pseudo grades. I might not have the chicken farm yet. That might be part of the problem. That might be why we're not getting the thick fog. How do you get the chicken farm? Does anybody know? <sighs> Did I say your last name correctly, Travis? Liming? I don't remember what I said. Is that still correct? <laughs> Goober, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Thanks for joining. Totally understand your rapid presence. I wasn't sure how many people would show up today because I know it's like the weekend for Christmas and people got a lot of shit going on, but yes, happy holidays to everybody. Merry Christmas. If you celebrate, I hope you guys, everybody's looking forward to the next few days with family or friends or however you're celebrating. All right. We got to make sure we get the menu prepped. Ooh, we have mantis. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not going to enhance this because I think if I enhance it, Oh, it's already at flavor level max. Okay. Boiled mantis shrimp with... Wait, 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 We got research to do, baby. A white shark omelet? That sounds absolutely disgusting, but we're going to research it. Yeah, give me that beautiful cutscene. Give it to me. Yeti, what's up, dude? Welcome, Dijon, Abe, Froman. Welcome, Camilla. Good to see you. Thanks for joining. All right, research complete. Six hundred and fifty dollars for this. Man, talk about you got to be a high roller to eat at this restaurant, dude. Um, we're gonna research this seasoned long spine porcupine fish skin. What a name for a dish. <laughs> what a name. <laughs> Because it's 180 coins. It's the most expensive one. Now we need more artisan flames. So. All right. We got to prep the menu for tonight. Apollo, you legend. Thank you so much, dude. I appreciate it. I'm assuming you are off work today, sir, or not working currently. All right. Mantis shrimp. We're definitely putting that on the menu. Got to remember to auto resupply everything, right? Right? Look, I got my, I'm smart. I got my, I got my uh, smart skilly hat on today. I'm actually going to do things correct. Things are going to work out. Despite how I started the stream. <laughs> I need like a, I need like a checklist, dude. I had, <laughs> I need like a visible checklist on the side over here that you guys can't see. Like can just be like, duh, you know. I can't be, I can't be, is IGP still here? I can't be four walls, four doors. I can't be doing that at the start of streams. Can't do that. Um, what else we got? We have 18 of this frilled shark meat. So we'll put, and that's worth quite, no, 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 no. Don't swap. Suck my ass. All right. What else we doing? We need stuff that has a lot. Ooh, 
Zebra shark meat. We have 30. If I enhance, it only takes three. Let's do it. Let's up that value, baby. Let's go. Yes. Thank you, Hannah. Everybody, make sure you're on live chat instead of top of chat because YouTube is stupid. I don't even know. Top of chat? Like, who uses that? Don't. It's. It, who would want that? YouTube. Get your shit together. Fix it. Get rid of it. It's unnecessary. <clears throat> All right. What else we got? What is this? Moray eel curry. I like curry. I don't like seafood. I like curry. What happens if we enhance this bad boy? Let's enhance it one time. And then we'll pop We'll pop this on the menu. Auto supply. And then what else we got going on here? Chambered Nautilus. God damn, dude. Do we have... We're going to... I think we're going to put some chambered Nautilus on the menu. I think we're going to do that. Because we've enhanced, we've enhanced it. I've enhanced it a bunch now, so it's it's like worth. All right. So we have now we had 93 chambered Nautilus. Holy shit! Hey, what's up, Misty? Welcome to the stream. Thanks for joining. Hey, listen. I know I I gave a shout out yesterday, but I want to. Hopefully, Misty's okay with this. I want to say something again. We talked to uh, Misty's uh, son, right? Had brain surgery been in the hospital recovering for a while we talked about him absolutely crushing it well she gave me the great news today that uh he gets to go home today he probably hopefully is already home so i just want to say dominic that's fucking awesome news dude so merry christmas and uh keep killing it man keep crushing it you i'm I, i'm so happy for you so proud to hear that man so you're an absolute badass dude all right let's get going we're going to open the restaurant. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, 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 I got a couple YouTubers, didn't I? Raptor? He's a thousand dollars to hire this guy. Oh, man. Look at his serving skill, though. 150. What are my current servers? 155 at level five. Yeah. I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to replace, I'm going to have to replace her. I'm sorry. I got to, I got to, you got to make the tough, as a business owner, you gotta make the tough decisions. I'm gonna hire this guy. We're gonna sign him. We're gonna sign him. And then we gotta. I, I feel like I gotta swap. Like his serving is almost better. We're gonna have a guy with a raptor head now. We gotta train him some too. He goes to 190 after getting to level two. Holy shit, dude. All right, we're gonna pop this guy up there. Hopefully he gets the drink serving skill because if he doesn't, it's gonna be all drink serving for me. Wasabi refill so he could do wasabi. Okay, sure, why not? Genlenial Entertainment with the $50 super chat said, Merry Christmas, Skilly. Rock that ocean with your motions. Genlenial, thank you so much. Hey, I really appreciate that, man. That helps out a bunch. So thank you, thank you. All right, he's at 230 serving wise now. He's going to catch up to old Billy Boo over here quicker than. What else do we have? 308? Yeah, I'm gonna keep training him. We're gonna get him up there, dude. Poor Dre's up here setting at level seven. He's pretty good at cooking. Dre's like a good all-arounder, but the skills that I have for him right now, they're all related to serving, but he's like my second highest kitchen stat, so. I forgot how bopping the music is here. Raptor seems to have prepared something. What have you prepared, dude? 23 gifts for each skillet your pocketbook has to be screaming yeah dude my ooh, it's been a lot of expenses i don't know if we talked about this but i um our dishwasher went out which i know first world problem we could survive without one we had to get a new dishwasher recently like last week and then too i don't know if you guys have noticed you you may have if you're very if you're very if you're on top of it uh, like very observant, but I have a new chair. You can't, you can't really see it. Uh, <laughs> I broke my chair. I broke my office chair. Like I literally broke the arm off of it. I, I don't even know how I did that. I feel like I'm not that hard on stuff. It was almost four years old, but uh, I had to buy a new chair, but I, I, it's a business expense, right? I went, I went and I was like, you know, I already have like a minor back issue. So I got something that was a little bit more expensive, but should last, has a really good warranty and is really supportive back wise. So I got something very ergonomic, I guess is the word you would say, right? So. Oh. 
Yeah, my chair broke. Yeah, you can't see. I'm sitting in the... I, what I got is the Herman Miller in body. Because I figured I spend a lot of time, right? Like, my work is setting at a computer. You know? The thing I do on the side. So, I don't know. Things happen in threes. I know. I know, Hannah. I know. So, we had the dishwasher, my chair. I don't know what else. Something else expensive is going to pop up. I know it is. You're absolutely right. He has another idea. Should I train him again? I should train him again, right? Let's get him up to Billy. Cocktail serving. Okay. Serve cocktails. Why not, bro? Do it, man. Does that mean he... I don't think he can pour beer, because I think beer counts as a drink. All right, that's all we're doing. I ain't training his raptor ass anymore. Look at the little dinosaur head sitting over there, dude. That's pretty cool, man. All right, I think we're officially ready to open tonight. Let's get to it. I'm going to have to do the tea, I think. Yeah, I'm going to have to do tea. I'm, sometimes I'm not the best at this. But we'll see how it goes. Oh, that was too full. That was bad. Yeah. Sorry about that. Ah, shit. That's not gonna get us a good rating. Perfect. Perfect. Come on, Dave. You gotta be more delicate with those chubby little fingers, dude. Ah, shit. What the hell is wrong with me? Oh, she's getting pissed. She's getting pissed because she ain't getting tea, bro. Hey, we've recovered. All right. Everybody won their damn drinks right away, bro. I gotta calm down. Good. Okay. I need a server who can also serve drinks, please. What kind of server doesn't know how to serve drinks? What the hell is this? We're not getting five stars tonight. All right, we did a nighttime dive, though, so that's why the night was so short, if you guys remember from last time. We did make $3,400, though. 4.4 stars out of five. Okay, it's not terrible. It's not the worst night ever. Just wasn't the best, you know? <laughs> we'll get there. We'll get there. <laughs> Tara said good try. Thanks, Tara. VIP visit. Finish gathering the ingredients. All right. Dr. Bacon! What's up, dude? Phew, it's not easy crafting a suit in one day, but I am me, so I did it. Oh, that looks nice. Bwahaha. Why don't you go ahead and try it on? So this is the suit that's going to allow me to go into the glacial area, right? The cold area. Oh, that suits you well. Genlineal Entertainment with the 20 gifted channel memberships. Welcome to channel membership, Camilla, Black Halfling, Anthony, Kai, Esoteric, Unapologetic Yen, Phoenix Locks, Christopher Eadman, uh, Hayes Buster, Lily Grant, Christine Manning, Jeremy Hurd, uh, who else did I miss? Uh, James McAllister, Vale Marie, Kalia, Kat, Jason. Ooh, woo! A lot of people. Welcome to channel membership, everybody. <laughs> Genlenial, thanks, dude. I appreciate that, man. Yo, you're crushing it today. You're starting us off strong, dude. Thank you, thank you. We are all green now. Yes, everybody join the green gang. It's awesome. Uh, but don't get gang green. That's bad. That's bad for you. Don't get that. But join the green gang. Don't get gang green, though. All right, haha, the size is perfect as well. Thank you. Yeah, dad joke. There we go. Ah, the size is perfect as well. That's what she said. There we go. Thank you, Dr. Bacon. It feels warm, maybe because it's made from the divine tree fruit cloth. With that suit, you can not only roam underwater, but also cold places freely. Good, time to go down to the glacial area. Mm, okay, we got this, dude. <laughs> Dude, Ghostbuster, this game, I, I'm not even joking. I'm not overselling this, right? Uh, it, it's, I think it's the perfect, like, casual, just relax, have some fun. You know, you can have a fun. If you're looking to have a fun, Dave the Diver is where you go. And it's a great stream game because it allows for a lot of interactivity with you guys. And there's, like, always something happening in the game. So it's really good. You got a cold resistant suit that protects you from the cold environment of the glacial area. Upgrade it further using I Diver to dive even deeper. Sammy's calling. Check. What's up, Dave? You doing good? You seem energetic today. Yeah. yeah, man. Can you come to the chicken farm real quick? I got something to show you. Okay. 
So, the chicken farm. Oh, this is what we needed. He was working on the chicken farm, and it wasn't open yet. That's why we couldn't get the dredge DLC going. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot, man. Okay. Chicken farm upgrade. That's what I'm fucking... All right, we gotta go there. Chicken farm, we gotta go there. That's what we gotta do right now. We gotta go to the farm. I don't want to go to the sea people. I want to go to the farm. Can I not go to the farm during the day? I think I got to do it later. 5,000. We still don't have enough. I could do the cargo box. I'm going to... I'm going to save money. I'm going to say That's what That's what we're going to do. Hold on. We might have to do posts. What kind of lunatic throws away a trash in the ocean? Oh, that's a sign at Bancho Sushi. I was like, what? She's taking a picture of a sign that says don't do it. But I guess I get it. What a lucky day yesterday. I probably won't see giant shrimp like that again. Oh, that's the mantis shrimp boss that we killed. <coughs> Shit, sorry, everyone. MC Sammy. You can see dolphins for Bacho Sushi. This is what you call peace of mind. Hey, it's our pink dolphin friend, guys. What's up, Josh G, man? Welcome. Hope you're doing good. Good to see you. I might have to travel. What do you mean I might have to travel? I got to travel somewhere? Where do I got to go? I'll go somewhere. You can see plastics floating in the water sometimes. It's bad for marine life, so be careful. I mean, I feel it feels weird liking that post. <laughs> all right, that's all the new posts. To-do list, uh, chicken farm upgrade. You can choose up to three missions. Uh, let's do this one. All right. Uh, mini games. We got to check out our little Tamagotchi fish m m thingy. Doohickey. Am I supposed to warn it? Why does it always pop up right there? Feed it. Feed it. Eat your food. And then, you know what? Oh, it likes that. It likes food. Let's give it a little snack, too. Make sure it's, it's, a, it's a growing little blob. I, I, we don't know what it's going to be yet. Let's play. Let's play with it, too. Oh, yeah, this fucking game. Oh, shit. Hold on. Uh, it's in the middle again. Is it always in the middle? Okay, let's try it one more time. Let's see if it's always in the middle. It's on the left. Look at that, dude. They get, I got the hand-eye coordination of a fucking... I don't know, of something. What, what has good hand-eye coordination? Give it a shot? Should I give it a shot? Alright. Does it need to go to the bathroom? Oh, it has, that's clean up, right? Yeah. It doesn't have any memories yet. Let it, can, if I feed it again, will it like me all the way? Let's see. Does it, does it like me all the way now? No. It's hunger? It's still hungry? Like, I gotta keep feeding it? Oh, there is no boat. It's only me that moves. That's deep, yo. That's, uh, that's, uh, philosophical. If anybody could tell me why that was a dad pun. It's still hungry. Let's feed it all the way. How is this? This thing is eating little shrimp that are bigger than it. It's ate like three of them already. There we go. It's all the way full. Okay. All right. Don't, don't die. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave you alone for right now. Uh, what, what else? Well, look, how's the weather looking? Has it changed? It's stormy every day. Well, go fuck yourself. What does this guy have? He has the upgrade thing. Flame rifle, triple axle. Hold on. Just because you could craft the flame stuff? Where's my new gun? No. Oh. All right, whatever. Get out of here. All right, I can't go back right now, it seems. I can only go to the sea people or the glacial area. So I'm gonna go to the glacial area, I guess. Let's do it. Fuck. We'll go to the chicken farm in the afternoon. I think you have to visit the farm in the afternoon now that I'm thinking about it. Yeti said, because I'm Philly. Yes, Yeti, you get all of the internet points. You get all the, sk the skilly points. Fizzy Queen, what's up, Fizzy Queen? Merry Christmas to you as well. I hope you're doing good. Good to see you. All right. We caught, let, you know what? Let's save our cargo capacity for the new fish. The new 
new fish in the in this area. All right. Wow, it's really warm. It's completely different from before. Well, time to really explore the area. All right, this is all brand new. This is completely... We have never been down here. It's very... It's very bright. It's very beautiful. Oh, and this music is popping, dude. This music is great. Gelatinous nailfish. How did I miss that? Bro, bro, bro. Get your ass here. I need to upgrade my gun. My gun is taking... My harpoon gun is taking more than one hit to do stuff now. I gotta upgrade it. Keeping the soy sauce. <coughs> oh, damn. That, uh... <laughs> Holy shit, dude. I got wrecked. I got absolutely wrecked. I didn't think it did so much damage. It took away so much oxygen. Holy shit. Gary with the 10 gifted channel memberships, Fizzy Queen, Sean, uh, Kusho, Jennifer, All You Epic, Gypsy King, Michelle, Nina, and Thomas. Welcome to channel membership on behalf of Carrie. Carrie, you legend. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Yeah, I mean, we are very late game, so I guess... <laughs> I guess I need to be more careful. Because, yeah, these fish aren't playing around anymore. Can I go? To, here we go. I'm gonna go to a goddamn farm, dude. Get this chicken thing unlocked so we can see some dredge content, bro. Oh, I got an egg. Uh, I needed that, didn't I, for a quest? I did need an egg from the vegetable farm. Why doesn't it say I got the egg? I need wheat, dude. I need to harvest some wheat. I've been leaving the wheat over here. I need wheat, bro. Uh-oh. Uh, is this wheat? What did I just get? I was gonna tell me what I got. All right. We're doing some farming. They do have giant spikes on their face. Yeah, I mean, yeah, this is true. You are correct. Is there, do I have wheat? What is that? What did I just pick up, an onion? I don't know my vegetable emojis. Carrots? Okay, I know what that is. That's wheat. That's gotta be wheat, bro. Alright, that- oh, hold on. Can I look at my inventory somewhere? I swear, I'm a, I'm a professional Dave the Diver. I really am. Uh, I think it's on the boat. It's on the boat that you can look at your inventory. I need to probably buy some seeds from you and replant shit. Yeah, yeah, man. Give me that wheat seed. I need wheat, apparently. Uh, why don't we do, why don't we do a couple of those? And then why don't we get some, oh, that was garlic that I picked up. We already have an eggplant. Let's get another carrot and another garlic, I guess, right? Growth fertilizer, pest fertilizer. Ah, we don't need all that. We're good, man. It's $3,000 to expand the rice paddy field. 
and then the regular field is 2,400. A watering can level two is 2,000. Jeez, man. All right, let's buy some wheat just in case. Yeah, I think we picked up wheat earlier, though. We need it for that quest. Let's also get uh, some eggs just because we needed it. There, we've marked everything off of our quest now. Okay, great. 450 coins for a grade A egg. You done lost your goddamn mind. Done lost this guy, this guy. Look at this guy. Highway robbery. Highway robbery. This man's charging exorbitant prices. It's, rid it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. All right, let's talk to uh, the rapper turned chicken farmer. What's going on, Sammy? Yeah. I was browsing the internet to buy a new instrument, and I found some awesome stuff on sale for a limited time. So I bought them just before the sale ended. By the way, I forgot to mention this. <laughs> Sorry. I always point at the camera. I don't know why I do that. I got to stop that. It feels unnecessarily like, I don't know. I, I, I talk with my hands a lot, but you guys can't see my hands because they're down here. Um, uh, so the stream yesterday, right? I was going through with you guys in the, in the phone app on Dave the Diver. We were checking out like all the music and stuff, right? And we played Hot Pepper Tuna, right? This Sammy Guy's song, which is like a rap song where he's like, Hot Pepper Tuna. Yeah, and it's got that like cool beat behind it, right? That got copyright claimed on YouTube. And so I can't monetize the video without editing, editing that part out, which I did. But I didn't know that song was copyrighted. They copyrighted that silly dub song. Apparently, that song was made by a legitimate, I think it was like a Korean rapper. <laughs> and they put it in this game for that character. And I didn't know that. And I thought that was really interesting. But anyway, it got copyright claimed by that that Korean rapper's, uh, I guess like his, you know, record company or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> now you don't, so, Anyway, I tell you guys that if I if I ever try to go to play that song again, please remind me that it's copyrighted and not to <laughs> not to play it. Now you don't need to worry about coming to the chicken farm when you're busy. Awesome stuff. What exactly did you Here it is, the first item in the egg storage box. This storage can keep up to 50 eggs. Yeah. Now you don't have to collect eggs every day. You can just wait until it fills up and collect them all in one go. Mm. Whoa. Shut out. That's not all. Behold the chicken feeder. Yeah. This machine automatically feeds your chickens and increases the egg production rate. Yeah. With these machines, you'll have the ultimate chicken farm. What do you think, Dave? Mm -hmm. They're amazing, mm -hmm. but I guess they're not free, right? Oh. Nope. I'm a bit short on cash since I'm prepared for a new album, <laughs> but I bought them at a special discount. Excuse me. It was pretty much a steal. I don't think Sammy can say no as long as there's a discount. Shut out. I'll hold on to them for now. Just tell me where you need them. Yeah. I can install them for free. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but they seem pretty useful. I should think about it. All right. How much do they cost, dude? Probably like thousands of coins. What does this say? It says you can now purchase a machine that will help you run the chicken farm. If you purchase an egg storage box, you can store up to 50 eggs without harvesting them. But okay. You can use the chicken feeder to automatically feed your chickens. You can increase the egg production rate depending on the type of feed. All right, dude. All right. What's the damage, bro? 17,000 coins? Have you lost your goddamn mind? You better drop that new album. You better be charging like... 1999 for that shit, dude. 17,000 coins. I haven't seen that much money in this game ever. The rapper is Go K, yeah. Yep. Is he is he shorty? You looked it up. He's Korean, right? I've gone off memory here. I looked this up. In a, in a tired, medicated stupor last night after stream. So, please, if I if I got it wrong, I thought it said he was Korean. I, I could be misremembering, though. All right. 17,000 coins. Yeah, he's Korean? Okay. I thought... Yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn, dude. 5,000 for the chicken feeder. My chickens are going to starve. I, I ain't got that kind of money. I ain't got that kind of money. They... they they're, they done lost their damn minds, that's for sure. How do I plant stuff again? What do I what do I do here, man? Oh, I gotta be on. Uh, it would probably help if I was had seeds out. I got it. I understand. 
You don't need to water stuff when it's raining, right? Anybody know how to farm? Because I sure as shit don't. I think I need to buy one more seed. One more seed. Let's see. What should I get, chat? Um, no, no, no. I don't want to talk to you. I want to buy shit from you, dude. First person to drop. What should I get? Wheat, carrot, eggplant, or garlic? First person in chat to say, oh, that's what I'll buy. Shorty said there's food in the ground. The chickens can eat that. And damn straight. It's raining, right? So the, like, the worms and shit should be coming up. That's what they can have. That's what they can have. Somebody in chat, guide me. Somebody pick the next seed. Maybe a better rice patty? Are there better rice patties? Oh, I can't buy rice seeds for some reason. I don't know why. Carrot. All right, there we go. Oh, that's the rock. Okay. All right. All right, there we go. Plant the carrots. All right. We don't have these fields unlocked yet. Nutrients? What am I supposed to do for nutrients? Why does it... Why is this just a box there? I don't, I don't need to water, right? Am I supposed to do something to plant the rice? This is what happens when I don't play the game. What do you need? Did you... You pooped? The dude. Stop pooping. Are you sick? Is that what that means? All right, let's clean up. Just swipe the poop away. That's how I... That's what I do with my poop. And then we got to give you some medicine because you're sick, I guess. All right, you feeling better? Ah, you're so needy. <laughs> it's like a kid that I'm taking care of. All right. Sorry, I finished my Mountain Dew. I had to set the can away. Let's give you some more food. Don't poop on yourself anymore. Why does it have lips? It's looking kind of scary now. It's one of those red-lipped fish we saw last night. Genlenial said rice is taken care of by the farmer, dude. Okay, good shit. I, I felt like I kind of remembered that, but I wasn't 100% certain. <laughs> oh, shit. I lost track of it, I think. No, it's in the middle. <laughs> I looked away, and I still got it. Good shit. All right. Nah, forget about you for now. All right. I've got everything for the special VIP day. We're going to go back to the boat. That's good. There's also that shark party thing going on right now, right? All right, we're going to do our, our... I guess the afternoon's not over. That's good that visiting the farm doesn't waste the afternoon. So we could go back to the glacial area then. All right, we're looking for a more successful dive than what we just had. Shorty said we know what happened to Skilly's Tamagotchi when he had one. Yeah, listen... I had Tamagotchis as a kid. I was terrible at keeping those things alive. I always had to restart them. Yeah, it was bad. It was bad. I've had a lot of pets in my life, though, and I did I did great with them. I did great with them. It's just the electronic pets. I, I, I don't know. I can't keep up with it. Maybe it's because I knew it wasn't important. I don't know. All right. Uh, hey! Fuck. Okay. All right. All right. I see you. We need some oxygen before we fight this guy again. What is this stuff? What is this stuff? <laughs> oh, shit, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. All right. All right. Okay. 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 All right. Everybody pop down. Pop down, everybody. Calm down. All right. We're good. Dude, that guy... His hitbox on you is ridiculous. All right, hold on. And we're gonna go back. We're not. We're not. We're not bitching out. We're gonna fight him again. Where did he go? Whoa, dude! Chill the fuck out, dude. All right, I go. Ha <laughs> ha! Bitch. Yeah! How you like that apples? All right, we're gonna take the whole carcass. We're gonna get our one of our subs. Narwhal. Did, did we? We 
Hey, buddy. Hey. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay. Hey. What just happened to me? Why? Why? why okay. Yeah, blow up! There's a bomb right there! Blow up. Blow up on his ass. Blow up on his ass! Oh, I gotta act him. I gotta act him evade it. I've, oh, dude. All right. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Shit. All right. All right. We got it. We got a plan now. There's also... We gotta, what kind of squid is that, dude? Is that an octopus? That's an octopus, isn't it? It's not a squid. Come on, Skilly. Why? Why won't it activate? Oh, I gotta be on it. Okay, come here. Come here. Come here. Ha ha, bitch! Oh, he keeps inking me. Stop inking me, dude. That's gross. Don't do that. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. There's ammo up here. I need to get it, dude. I need to get it. I don't know what kind of shark that is, but it is. It's it's scurry. Get the ammo. Get the ammo. Get the ammo. Get the ammo. Thing here, do I can I drop the thing on it? 
The glacial creatures do appear to be thick skinned. That didn't do anything. What's under there? Is it like a hermit crab? Some type of crab? Come here. How do I get you? All right, you're not doing anything. Ah! Dude, I'm not even getting the option to pull this thing in. Like, holy shit, man. These fish are so strong in the, is it dead? Okay, there we go, ice fish. We've gotten that one before. There are three species of octopi in the Arctic. I was curious myself, so I looked it up. Uh, that is amazing to me. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> Octopuses are really smart, aren't they? Like, they're very intelligent, if I remember correctly. All right, we're starting to reach the, our depth limit for our suit. I think it's 550 meters is our limit. We're at 530. So we're getting there. Look at that narwhal back there. And then the jellyfish. Whoa, huge jellyfish. What was its name? Lion mane or something? Anyway, it's a giant jellyfish in the glacial area. It must make a nice photo. Let's take a pic. Hell yeah, dude. I'm assuming the optional is gonna be getting the narwhal in the photo, right? Capture with narwhal, yep. All right, we got this shit. We're gonna get this perfect photo. Let's zoom in a little bit, baby. Hey, I feel like I feel like I could have got the narwhal in there a little bit more, but we're gonna we're gonna keep that because we got all the objectives. Nice, that was a good shot. Uh, hell yeah, dude. Yo, bro, bro, I think better stay away. I just feel like jellyfish and octopus and stuff—they look otherworldly, right? Like they feel like. I mean, obviously they do belong on this planet because they are on this planet, but I feel like, I feel like th they don't belong to this planet. <laughs> What's up, Pen KP? Welcome to the stream. Good to see you again. Yeah, I do. I do need to upgrade my stuff. I need money though. Even in such a cold place, there's still something for such a big creature to eat. The deep sea really is a mysterious place. It is, my friend. <laughs> All right. Let's keep going. We are getting, oh, it's getting, wait, I feel some heat coming up. I can't go down further now. Oh man, I've reached my limit, but there's like a, there's like a, a little shrimp. Fuck, there's a little shrimp thing right there. This is, all right, 533, we've reached our depth limit. Can we get to 34? I can get to 34. Okay. All right, that's as far down. I guess we have to upgrade our suit. Do we have to get heat resistant now? I, I'm sure there's... <laughs> what the fuck is that thing, dude? What the fuck is that thing? I can't believe I'm gonna fight this thing. This is so... This is such a stupid ass idea. This is so stupid, but I'm gonna do it. All right, bro. All right. All right. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Okay, okay, okay. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. We gotta get it. Yeah! Let's go! What is this? Oh, man, I wish I had saved our transport. Holy shit, what is it? Greenland shark meat. Greenland shark. Holy shit. It's so big. So fucking big. So big. All right, what else is down here? That is the second new shark species that we've encountered in this area. I need air too. Hopefully I don't run out. I can't wait. I got to get back up. I can't waste this. All these new fish that I've caught. I can't waste this stuff. I got to get up after this. We got a jade marble. And that we need a grenade launcher or something to get into, right? All right, we got to get out of here. I can't die. I've only got 69, but we've gotten... <laughs> what a time to look over. And see how much air I have left. Hey, take care, Dijon. Thanks for joining and supporting while you can. I appreciate it. Babylon Sky, what's up? I think you've been here for a while, but welcome. Good to see you as always. Garden, the fermenting sound. Good to have you again. Welcome, welcome. Um, I, oh God, 
God, I need air. Maybe an oxygen tank in this. There's gotta be some air somewhere. Oh, I can teleport back. Oh, you know what? You know what? Hold on. Can I use the shovel to, to do this? No, no, no. Okay. That was a wish. Wishful thinking. All right, let's get back to the boat because we got... I don't know that there's any more air down here, but we have some great stuff. So... All right. We made it. We sur I survived. I fought two massive-ass sharks, a narwhal, fucking that octopus, and we just hit our highest depth. 534 meters. Let's fucking go, dude. All right. Good shit. Udo's calling. Oh, you brought a picture of something. Can I see? Wow, a giant jellyfish. The tentacles look like a lion's mane. Did you hear something growling? Uh, just kidding. You can't hear anything underwater. I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. Hey, we got some money for that. We got 900. That's my math right there. There are photo spots all over the place. Thank you for your help and keep up the good work. Good shit, man. Good shit. Dude, I can't wait to get lower. I love finding... That's one of the great things about this game, right? It's like they just constantly keep throwing new stuff at you. And it's never like filler content, right? It's content that makes sense, fits in the game and the play style of the game and the story and everything. And it's just so cool to like uncover all this stuff. At least it is to me. I don't know. I don't know about everybody else. It is to me. We got to turn the light off because he's sleeping, right? That's what it told us to do. And I think we completed... No, we didn't complete any research. Okay. We are one... Where is it at? We are one orange starfish away from completing that starfish research. Okay. Good stuff. Um, it's nighttime. We should do... We, we got to do the VIP event. So we got to go to the restaurant to do that, right? How do I... How do I... Sushi farm fish. I don't want to... I want to go to... Oh, it's evening? Aren't I... I don't want to dive at night. I want to go to the restaurant. Why can't I go to the restaurant? I can't look at your shop. What guns do I have? I should probably be... I want to go to the restaurant. Or does it have to be... Do I get to use nighttime now? Is it not restaurant time? Sushi. I guess go to sushi, right? I thought it, I thought it said poncho. I might be dumb, though. You hope, you're hoping I run into the one octopus that they recently found? Dude. That was the first... Was that the first octopus we've run into? It might be. Hello, everyone. This is you from NDC Station. Hello. Ladies and gentlemen, as you know, today is the day of the showdown in the Challenge the Chef. Pacho, are you ready? Of course. And Wang Peng. The same. I can't wait. Excellent. Then let's begin Challenge the Chef now. All right. This is probably going to be a badass cutscene, right? I'm going to cut it for the cutscene, baby. little mustache oh my god tiger versus dragon bacho will compete with a famous chef in a new tv show let's bring him the ingredients he asked for all right prep the carrot prep the carrot how do we do this i don't have any instructions prep prep got it did it Look at me, Master Chef, baby. Absolute Master Chef going on over here. <laughs> I love these stupid little mini games. They're so silly. Perfection. Look at me chop those onions. Prep the Stargazer. All right, this fish. Ooh, no, thank you. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got it. All right. <laughs> Oh, I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. That was not perfect. Cut, 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 cut. X. Cut, 
Cut, cut. All right, uh, we still got part. All right, all right, man. Coat the, ooh, coat the, we gotta use chopsticks? Dude, I suck with chopsticks in real life. All right, dip, and then you gotta spin. <laughs> So silly. Code it, code it, code it. Gotta do it just right, baby. One more piece. One more piece. One more piece, baby. One more piece. One more piece. One more piece. That was not easy. <laughs> You gotta hold. And then I guess I gotta let go when it's in the green. Oh, fuck, dude. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, I gotta hold it. Hey! I did it. Stir fry the ingredients. Stir fry? Stir fry the ingredients. What am I doing here? All right, shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. shake. Shake, 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 shake,
Is El Nino a YouTuber? Because his cost is really high. He has a really good serving stat, though. You know what? I'm going to train up Raptor more for serving. 1300? Maybe not. Man, yeah, JK. JK, LOL. 1300? Nah, no. I'm going to train her up for uh, cooking. Because it doesn't cost that much yet. You're going to hunt monsters while supporting? Hell yeah, Jin Lineal. What are you guys playing? If you don't mind me asking. I'm sorry. You might have said earlier and I missed it. All right, training. Cooking plus plus. All right, let's do it. Good shit. So she's like, she's like really high cooking wise. Is she a YouTuber? Maki? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe, 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 maybe not. All right. We got to prep the menu for tonight. Uh, we're going to do more star. Oh, we could do that stargazer. Oh, yeah. Let's do the stargazer that we just won the competition with. Um, we have a bunch of Mega Mouth Shark stuff. Let's do that as well. Auto supply. What else are we going to put on here? Oh, let's do the Greenland Shark meat, dude. And let's enhance it one time. Let's enhance it one time. <laughs> I love these cutscenes so much. They're so good. Remind me of anybody watch Samurai Jack? Anybody else watch Samurai Jack? As a kid from Cartoon Network, kind of has that vibe a little bit, right? Sometimes. I haven't thought about that show in a long time. Now I want to go watch some of it. That's definitely what it reminds me of, some though. Goober said loved Samurai Jack. Samurai Jack was great. Didn't they do uh didn't they come back and like do uh was it a movie or like uh like a, a short like it wasn't a reboot, that's the wrong word. Like uh continuation or something, didn't they? You're playing Monster Hunter Rise? Hell yeah, dude. I never played Rise. Uh Monster Hunter World is the last one that I played. We should do more Monster Hunting games though. For stream and such would be a good idea all right we're putting that on there because we just enhanced it pelican eel yeah, nah, nah. nah dude let's put that greenland shark meat out there though for real we just got that baby all right i need three more dishes right uh poor beagle shark meat we have quite a bit of and we can enhance it to be worth 200 so let's do that and then Yep, menu, on the menu you go with auto supply. Two more. Something that has quite a bit. Well, okay, we'll continue to do frilled shark. We got a lot of, we're like a shark meat restaurant now, dude. But that's what sells. That's what sells, man. Let's enhance the, we're gonna do narwhal too. I feel like we got some really exotic, exotic sushi now going on. Exotic, exotic, exotic. Came back and finished the story yet, he said. Yeah, I thought so, yeah. Yeah, I never saw the I never saw that. I never saw the the comeback season or whatever you want to call it, whatever it was. Uh I need to check that out someday. You know what I just watched is Yu Yu Haka Show, the live action five episode series on Netflix. That was actually I actually liked it. I feel like they stayed true to the original for them. That was perfect. Well, that was perfect. Okay, sure. Um, it was. It wasn't the best thing ever, but it was. It was okay. That was bad. How was that one bad? But the other one was okay. How am I so bad at this? I'm terrible at drinking, y'all. Okay. I need a server who can pour drinks again because I'm bad at this. That's gotta, I was about to say, that's gotta be perfect, bro. I got you. I got you, lady. Calm down. You gotta do like little squirts with the beer. Everybody gets so fucking impatient. Chill out. Chill out, people. Chill out. 
My one server, my one server, my one server does wasabi, though, so I don't have to worry about that, which is nice. That's too much foam, man. That's too much foam. All right, whatever you say. That was not good. We're gonna get like four stars for that. I fucked up. I fucked up the drinks so much. We made 6,000. 4.7. How was that better than the other night? I feel like I only screwed up two drinks the other night. And I screwed up like three or four this time. And I got a 4.7. Huh. Hey. Somebody explain this to me. 6,647. All right. That wasn't a bad night. That was all right. <laughs> Goober said we're disappointed, Skilly. Yu Yu Hakshu, first episode good. Rest can go to hell. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I will say, I think it started stronger than it ended. Maybe it was just because it had been a long time since I had seen Yu Yu Hakusho, and it was nice to, like, revisit that universe. It made me want to... I immediately went on Amazon, and I was like, can I buy the, the series on Blu-ray? And I think they had it. But I think it was, like, $100 or something, and I was like, I don't need to spend money on this. Like, I don't need... I will, like... It's, I, I could find it somewhere, probably streaming or something. So, I just have really fond memories of like being like 12 or 13 and watching that anime uh, on uh, Toonami, I think. And I, I really liked Yu Yu Hakusho. Wait, can I have a moment with you? Oh, you are that reporter from before. Do you need help with something? Thanks to you. Thanks to your help, my boss entrusted me with a new project. I'm sure a promotion will be in order. Well, anyways, tell me, sir, have you seen extremely novel fish inside this giant blue hole? Um, there are fish from many different locales in there. What do you mean by novel? I mean very peculiar fish. The sort no one has ever discovered before. Our magazine has a secret weapon, the fish radar. And it tells us that... The and it tells us that this blue hole is a treasure trove of undiscovered species. <laughs> we weekly fish are planning a series of we weekly fish are planning a series of specials over the next few months to showcase these precious new fish. It's called the Catch Them All Project. We can research the fish on the weekdays. So that's another Pokemon reference, by the way. And if you can catch specimens for us over the weekends, <laughs> they'll be featured in the specials that we'll be publishing in the Weekly Fish every Monday. Yes, Monday. <laughs> Me? Catch them? <laughs> well, you are kind of the only diver in these parts, aren't you? <laughs> I'm not really following your logic. Oh. In any case, as we have to have... We... Wait, wait, wait. As we have to have the issues ready by Monday, you'll have to catch the specimens by Sunday evening at the latest. <laughs> but that's tomorrow, isn't it? This this is just too sun. Now then, let's get down to business. The fish we spotted with our radar this week was the humphead parrotfish. Dude, that is an abomination of nature right there. What is that thing? Does it have hair? Is that fucking hair on a fish? Get the fuck out of here. No, 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 sir. I'm sorry. If I ever see a picture of a fish with hair or a fish that looks like it has hair. Nope, that's enough. That's, en that's enough internet for today. Hmm, a horned parrotfish. I've never seen anything like it. Yeah. The location is close to the boat wreck. Uh, that's what I can detect. Oh, and uh, I'll give you this fish tracker. If there's a fish mon you need to catch nearby, it'll vibrate and play a sound. Uh, oh, don't be surprised. Guess what this device could do. Uh, it allows you to see all the information about fish even while diving in the water. You can see your best grade fish, how many fish you have in your restaurant and fish farm and more. Uh, is that right? But how is that possible when I didn't link my device yet? Uh, <laughs> Did this man hack my fucking device? Did he hack my fucking device? <laughs> oh, you are a bit clueless, aren't you? By the way, good luck then. That's till Sunday or tomorrow evening to be precise. Um, this is sudden work for a magazine. Come to think of it, I think I've seen the boat wreck in passing. New content, weekly fishing. Strange creatures will sometimes appear in the giant blue hole. <laughs> I can't say the phrase giant blue hole with straight face. They've called Fishbon and are anything but easy to catch. Get information from the journalist Udo who comes on Saturdays. Fish Tracker, right? From now on, you can use Fish Tracker underwater with up. Use this device to count the number of ingredients from the fish farm and sushi restaurant and check the grade of the fish you catch while you're still in the water. 
All right. Farming report is available. There's a new thing. A horned parrotfish captured near the boat wreckage. Is that near the boat wreckage in the glacial area? Or the boat wreckage in the shallows here? I don't know because there's two plate. We might have to do like a super long dive and check both places. We might have to. We might have to check both. We might have to. All right. Well, how's our fucking Tamagotchi Gaio thing? Hey, what's up, dude? Are you hungry? Yeah, you're hungry. You're two years old? Man, time moves really different for you. It's really strange. All right. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, 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 nom. All right, what else do you need? Affection? I guess I gotta play with you. I don't understand how me guessing where the pearl is hidden is playing with you, but, you know, it's over here. I'm just built different, dude. I'm too, I'm too good for this little, this little shitty kids game. This little, the, where is it at? It's over here. Ha <laughs> ha! How you like them apples? Look at me. It's like a magic, dude. Hey, look at that. We got the affection and the hunger all the way up. What does warning do? I don't know, I don't know what that does. I don't know what that does. When is he going to transform into one of these crazy ass things? Why does it still have a question mark there? Like, I need to do stuff with him. He's like happy. Everything's okay. All right, whatever. One of these days, I might accidentally forget about him and then things won't be okay. What's the weather? Where's our fog? Whoa, 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 whoa. We got thick fog, baby. We got it. That means we need to finish today in game and then we need to finish one more in game and then the dredge content comes, baby. 1031, we got it. We got it. All right, we got to finish this up. Good shit, dude. A large sushi fit for the large Greenland shark. There we go. Vincent is still eating even after filming has stopped. He must really like it. We'll go ahead and like that. All right, we've done all the stuff. What do I need to rank up, bro? I still need 65 best taste. How do I get that? How do I do it? God damn it. All right, all right, all right, all right. Should we change? Can we upgrade weapons, not enough materials? Suck my ass. Um, only have enough to do underwater rifle. Nee, 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 nee. Nee, nee, nee. We're good. I need better weapons though. Can I upgrade? How much money do I have? No, 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 no. Where's the eye diver? I need to upgrade my harpoon, dude. 9,000 coins? Uh, okay, let's upgrade our suit, though. We need to go deeper, right? Limit 800 meters. Okay. Oh, it's max. It's max level right now. All right. Uh, where's the... If we look at our tasks... We need a cookie cutter shark. Glacial area. And then... A horned parrotfish boat wreckage. I really feel like that might not be in the glacial area, but we'll try. Try. Let's go to the glacial area. Yu Yu Hakusho fan. I know it's on Crunchyroll and I think it's on Hulu. Yeah, I was thinking I hadn't looked yet. I was thinking it might be on Hulu. Thanks for that tip though because now I'm going to check. I would like to rewatch it. It's not a long series if I remember. It's only like a... Well, I'm going to say it's not a long series. By some anime standards, it's not that long. I think it's only like 112 episodes, right? Like the entire run. Which, you know, 20 minute anime episodes. That's not that long. Dude, I don't want to... I guess I could fight you. I could use... I could use... Ow, okay. Hey, buddy. Ah! Oh, fuck, dude. I'm so dead. One more hit. I'm dead. I don't have enough air. Fuck, dude. No way. Yeah, I'm dead. I think I have uh, the thing on. Yep, 
I'm dead. <laughs> Dude, that narwhal is ridiculous. That thing is insane, man. The reach on that fucking long ass horn, dude. That was so bad. Oh, fuck. What does this guy need now? Stop pooping. Is he transforming? Why is he so big now? He's all grown up. What's it say? You need to eat again. Yeah, those narwhals hate me. They're both of my deaths so far this stream. It's a shame. Is oh, is, is it is it full? All right, and we need to play a game with it real quick. This thing is taking a lot of care to keep alive. It's in the center. Oh, he's so happy. Okay, forget you. All right, we gotta go back down. I'm gonna stay so. I'm gonna stay so far away from that fucking thing, dude. No, thank you. I yeah, I died to the narwhal earlier. Not that quickly, but hey, hey, gun enhancement right here. Hosh start. No, thank you. Oh, I could disassemble it though. That's right for parts. No, 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 no. What is it? Hold down Y to disassemble. There we go. All right, we got four fragment. Okay. Mooney Tooney, what's up? Welcome to the Mooney Tune. I'm sorry. Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Merry Christmas to you as well. All right, we're going to stay away from that. We are looking for. Hey, we can check our. Uh, we can check our, our Fishma Bishes right here. Fishmon. We are looking for. A tough bone helmet that blocks all frontal attacks. Okay, it has a bone helmet. Okay. Hey, there's a crab right there. We got a new uh, starfish. We got a tranquilizer harpoon. I wonder how that'll work against our... Uh... All right. Is there a thing I can drop on this guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, come on, come on. We're gonna drop an ice block on this thing. Oh! That little ass fish dropped my ice block? You gotta be kidding me. Ah, uh, no, oops. I fucked up the shot. Hold on. That doesn't hurt it? Hold on a sec. not care i don't know how to kill that thing then now that the ice block thing got messed up Ooh, song. dude don't tell me something bigger is coming <laughs> please i will freak out we've had we've encountered something there's big stuff in dave occasionally so Put him to sleep. And then I can get him. Hey! Good shit, dude. I'm assuming that has a chance to like randomly happen. I'm gonna use my last bullet here to get one of these fish. Actually, one of these. Well, that didn't work because there's ammo over here. All right. I really wish the rifle had more than three rounds in it. Dude, the music in Dave is great. I think we were talking last stream. I would love a Dave the Diver soundtrack. You could probably get the music somewhere. Level three enhanced harpoon. No, I want to keep the level three trank harpoon. Did it tranquilize this fish? I miss. Of course I miss. All right, we're looking for some sort of... What is this? It's too cold? Oh, okay. I need better mining equipment. Damn. This glacial area music is on point though. It's really good. By the way, for those wondering, I have played Dave the Diver on Steam Deck. If you have a Steam Deck, plays fantastic, great. Battery life is pretty good with it too. Uh, I have another Steam account. I haven't surpassed what we've done in this game. 
game. I'm actually not as far. <laughs> but I like Dave the Diver so much that I uh, I have it on my other Steam account that I don't use for work, and I had it downloaded to like play as like a chill game, like when I'm traveling with the family, like when I'm visiting the in-laws and stuff, and I've played some there. It's, it runs fantastic on the Steam Deck. It's really good. frozen fish that can be used as a blunt weapon. It has a chance to instantly freeze the target. Harpoon damage plus one has a 30% chance to freeze the target for seven seconds. Inflicts 30 damage to the frozen. Dude, you can hit him with a frozen fish, bro. That's a new melee weapon. <laughs> we haven't encountered that before. <laughs> I'm looking like I'm out of a porthole right now. Super relaxing. I didn't even think about that. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. The lighting works out just perfect, huh? It froze that fish solid. Look, the fish is frozen. <laughs> and then you hit it and it unfreezes. That's, that's fucking cool, dude. I don't know if I've caught, are these the gelatinous fish bobs? Come here, bitch. I wanna catch you. See if I've gotten you before. Oh, I gotta do like some. There we go. Polar eel pout. I don't think I had caught that before. Oh my gosh, what is this? Ah, uh, the current here is too strong to enter. I can't go in there. Aww. What is this? A jade pedestal. A jade divine tree pedestal, just like candles used by humans to see people seem to have used the divine tree as a source of light. All right. It's a new item. Oh, we have air right here. I'm going to leave that for right now. We need to catch some more of these fish around here. Yeah! I actually completed that minigame. I'm really bad at doing that minigame. Also, Misty said officially home. Time to relax a bit. What's up, fam? Miss you all. Hell yeah, Misty. That's awesome. I'm so happy for you and Dominic and you guys that you, you got home from the hospital in time for Christmas. That's awesome. It was really impressive, too. I would not have been ready to come home that soon after brain surgery, dude. Dominic fucking killing it over there. That's, that's amazing. Come on, give me the prompt. Give me the mini game. To pull the fish in. What's wrong with you? Do you know who I am? I'm Dave the motherfucking diver, dude. You don't know who you're dealing with. You don't, he, he, he doesn't know. Ah, uh, you do now. I like that. They're putting him to sleep. Uh, that's, that's, that's cute. All right, we got a haddock again. All right. I might need to go back and get that air. I'm starting to think that there's no boat wreckage here in the glacial area, and that fish that I need to get is actually in the shallows. <laughs> oh, that sounded like such a hard hit, and it just put the, the fish, like, right to sleep. Is it? I'm hitting him, but it just keeps putting him to sleep. I want to catch him. Oh, wait. I might actually not be hitting him. Come here. Come here. Josh, no, uh, Misty didn't. Her oldest son, Dominic, uh, did. He had brain surgery. And he's been recovering from it. Hit a fish with a fish? I know. That's weird, right? That's weird. All right, we got the air. Let's go back. Misty said, dude, right? I'd be a freaking vegetable kid is stronger than any 10-year-old has a right be. He absolutely is. He's amazing. I get a I get a cold. I get a cold and I want to lay in bed for like five days and I'm a, a whiny bitchy mess. <laughs> Like you're hitting 
another fish with a frozen fish. That's hilarious. Plus, how strong is Dave that he can swing a frozen fish underwater with that much force, dude? Our boy Dave is, uh, he, he's, I think he's secretly buff. He's got that, like, cat butt strength. You know what I mean? Oh, shit. I fucked up. I fucked up that minigame. Messed it up. All right. We are, did we went down here, right? I went down here, I think. We gotta go. Maybe not. No. No, I didn't go down here. Okay. All right. We are at 513 meters. That's the deepest we've ever been. No, it's not. We went to 534, right? We're getting close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've been, we've been, we've been to this area. Oh, oh, hush, there. No. Oh, I'll disassemble it, though. I'll disassemble it for parts. Guys, I'm really excited for tonight. We talked about taking uh, my family and I going to the hockey game. My oldest son has been a couple of times with just me, like me and him for like a father-son kind of thing. But my youngest now is two and a half. He's, he's maybe like a little too young to understand, but he's old enough that we felt like he could he could go. So my wife's going to come too. My wife's been to a couple before, before we had kids, but... It should be really fun. It's going to be interesting to see if my two-year-old's reaction to the hockey game and, like, what's going on. He gets really excited, I feel like, about stuff like that. Whenever he's, like, watching something on a TV show or there's, like, action, he gets really excited. So I can't wait to see what he says. Wait, I feel some heat coming up. I can't go down further now. Okay. Oh, dude, I got to get this guy. I wonder if I could freeze him with my fish. Hell yeah, dude. Look at that. That froze his ass. Okay. All right, buddy. All right, buddy. <laughs> oh, now I put him to sleep. I put him to sleep with the tranquilizer. I just gotta get these status weapons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know there's heat. Oh, fuck, dude. Damn it, damn it. Yeah! All right, we're gonna get him. We're gonna get him taken up because we didn't last time. I think there's air over here too, right? That I skipped over because I didn't really need it. So we'll get that after fighting him. <laughs> Panthera said, I can't believe that worked. I know, it's great, dude. That, this might be one of the best melee weapons because that freezing mechanic is awesome. Such a cool, it's such a, it's such a funny, cool idea. It fits the game really well, too. Come here. Freeze, bitch. There you go. And then I like when you harpoon it after that, it like, uh, it pops up. Like, it, it like breaks the ice, right? And it makes a different sound. So that's awesome. A caplet. There's a million of these things everywhere. Going everywhere. No! Okay. They're all running because I took all their friends. Night Rider, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Thanks for joining. Dude, this I I could listen to this this background music on repeat. Come here. Come here. Come here. You can't escape, Dave. Can't do it, man. I'm gonna hit. I'm. Gonna, you know what? Freeze, freeze, bitch. Freeze, freeze, freeze. Come here. Freeze, damn it. Are you immune to being frozen? What is wrong with you? Freeze, dude. This fish can't be frozen. Is this one of the ice fish? Maybe the ice fish can't be frozen. second dude this thing is not dying that haddock would not die dude hey what's up sentient welcome thanks for joining sentient with the 20 dollars donation said hi skilly and chat just dropping in to say hello doing our christmas party today 
and just waiting on my sister to show up before we eat and do gifts. Well, hell yeah, man. Merry Christmas to you and the family. And I hope you guys have a good one today. And I appreciate you popping in and the dono, dude. Thank you. Thank you. You're a legend. What you guys having, if you don't mind me asking, Sentient, what you guys having for uh, the Christmas dinner or the Christmas food? All right, we don't have a lot of these Southern Bell things, so I'm gonna get all those. Things. I like the idea of hitting a plant with a frozen fish, and that's how you, uh, that's how you cut it down. <laughs> Seeing so many names from the beginning times makes me really miss control from the beginning times. Peanut Prime, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Thanks for joining. Merry Christmas to you. This is a really chill game. Yeah, I don't know. I just, when I sat down today to stream, even though I said I was going to do Alan Wake last night, this felt, Dave the Diver felt more appropriate. I don't know why. Plus, I really wanted to play more. I really want to play Alan Wake too. There's so many things I want to play and finish. But it, it just felt like a Dave the Diver kind of day. It's just got those, it's got those good vibes, you know? Why is there a... Oh, ooh, what is that, bro? What the fuck? Come on, dude. Oh, it's asleep. It's still asleep. <laughs> I got it upside down, dude. It's asleep again. This is a... Oh, no, I fucked. Dude, what is this? Some kind of uh, stingray, right? A starry skate. Okay. Are skates stingrays? I've heard of skates before, but I don't know if they're stingrays or not. Kind of looks like it, right? It looked like it had a crazy tail. What are you having, sentient? I missed it. Ice Gilly Chats, Trevor Desalo, blah, 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 blah. Uh, ham, pigs in a blanket, sweet potatoes, baked beans, deviled eggs, bunch of finger foods, and homemade candies. Oh, that sounds delicious, dude. That's good stuff, man. Alan Wake does take a little bit more brain power. Plus, it's a little, it's a little more, it's a little more, it's a little more stressful, you know? I mean, I think I'm gonna do the flame rifle for now. It's just, uh, it's, it's, yeah, it's, uh, it's more stressful. And I'm, I'm, I'm a little under the weather, so I was feeling a little bit more of a, a chill game. Plus, to interact with you guys a little bit more. That's always a positive. That flame rifle's nice, dude. B Y B. All right. I feel like I'm getting better at that mini game. Can't go any further that way. Okay. We're racking up on the ice fish here, which is good. Come here. Come here. You're not getting away from me. I don't know where you think you're going. Ah, you're asleep. Dude, this combo, ice fish and twink and twink. <laughs> Why did I tell you? Ice fish and twink will I do I have the the ice fish and the tray carpoon are is really good. I'm gonna be really at some point we're gonna complete Dave the Diver. I'm gonna be really sad. I'm gonna be sad. It's gonna be sad when when we finish Dave. Such a good game. Okay. All right, dude. All right. Hey, you know what? Oh, I missed. All right, buddy. You're on fire. That's what you get, bitch. I'm gonna... Ha <laughs> ha! How about them apples? This thing, this narwhal is like my fucking nemesis down here, dude. This thing is vicious, man. Absolutely vicious. Eric Adams, what's up? Eric Adams said, hey, you know you can capture tranquilized fish? Uh, I knew that, but I forgot, and you have just reminded me. <laughs> so thank you. All right, let's see, let's see. That's right, you just go up to them and press X, right? If they fall asleep. Let's see if we can get another fish to fall asleep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Thanks, man. I 
knew this. It, this isn't the first time we've had the Trey Carpoon. I just, you know, it's... <laughs> Alright, good shit. Oh! A door. And there's a stone slab with text in front of the door. I should take a picture of it and ask Dr. Bacon to decipher. Alright, good shit. Let's do it. <clears throat> um... Hold to focus. There's no special objective. Alright. We actually gotta be over here. Okay. It's not... What? What is wrong with me? Hold. Make sure it's green. Good job, Skilly. This picture is good enough. Let me go up and show Dr. Bacon. All right, good shit. Return to the boat. So we can... I'm not going to take that air just yet. I want to know how to... What do I do with those rocks? I'm going to take the ice fish back. Don't worry, guys. I just wanted to try the shovel again here. There's something under those rocks that do that, but I don't know what it is. Oh, that's my rifle. I meant to have my harpoon out. Silly skilly. That also is giving me three star fish because they're tranquilized and I'm not messing up the meat so much because they fall asleep. That's good stuff. How did that miss? miss i feel like i got robbed right there dude i got robbed this this fish what is, what is going on with you buddy where where who do you think you are all right yeah yeah that's what i thought yeah we're getting three stars tomorrow on sunday is christmas day for you in norway it's your, is it so you guys camilla you celebrate christmas on the 24th or is tomorrow the 25th for you Today's Saturday, right? Is today Saturday? I just feel like a Saturday to me for some reason. Might be because it's been so busy with the holiday. It's been so flippin' busy, dude. How do I get up? Where was the way up? It is Saturday, yeah. Sometimes I lose track of days, dude. Because, uh, we're, you know, my job work from home. It's just, you know... Weekends don't change that much for me, except for I don't sit down and work. I mean, that is different, but it's not that different. Mooney Tune, you're in Denmark. Hell yeah. We got the Nordic countries represented. And it said, yep, tomorrow on the 24th. Interesting. I like it. You guys change it up. Yeah, tomorrow is Christmas Eve for us folks here in America, which... It's usually a holiday for a lot of people, too. Like, uh, not everybody, depending on what your work is. But a lot of people have off. And usually, like, American families will do... They have, like, Christmas Eve traditions. Or, like, you get together with family. Or, like, a tradition that... My, like, growing up, we used to do is... The presents get put out Christmas Eve night. And then uh, everybody gets to pick and open one gift before Christmas morning. So, NKP said it's already the 24th in our place. Oh, that's awesome. Sunday here in Oz. It's already Sunday in Australia. Interesting. Dude, that's a, the time zone thing and the different times. It's always, it always baffles me. <laughs> right now, guys, what I'm doing is I'm just looking for a mirror to go back up to the boat because I feel like we're, we're at 98.6 kilograms, so we've loaded up on a bunch of ingredients and fish and everything down here. So we just need to get we just need to get back. Uh, and I thought I could do it by going all the way up, but I got lost and I can't figure out how to get all the way up. So I'm looking for one of those mirrors that will transport me. I've gotten turned around though. That's a good question, Jack. Jack O'Lantern, what's up? Welcome, by the way. Welcome back to the stream, or welcome to the stream. Good to see you again. Here we go. Here's a mirror, dirt, dirt. We're gonna go back now. I will take, I don't need ammo, okay. All right. That's okay, is that, yeah, is that a European thing, or is that like a Nordic country thing, or is it just like a Denmark and Norway kind of thing? Like, what, what, it, it, do a lot of Europeans celebrate Christmas on, 
uh, Christmas Eve, or what I guess Americans would call Christmas Eve, the 24th. Uh, let's go back to the boat, bro. Dr. Bacon, could you take a look at this picture? Oh, an ancient stone slab of the sea people, but it is very old and poorly weathered. No matter, should be enough to run the decoding equipment with. Can you hold that picture for a moment? Dijon said, no, I'm from Holland and ours is the same. Okay. Skilly and you open gifts the 25th, right? Yes. Yeah. We open gifts on the 25th. I did not find the horned parrotfish. That's not good. <laughs> Decipher all this is a mini game, so I gotta like move this around and decipher all of it. Okay, we're gonna do we're gonna do this very scientifically. We're gonna do left to right, right to left. You know, we can do this. I feel like I'm a scientist, dude. Look at me over here solving ancient mysteries and shit, bro. I'm gonna get my own Discovery Channel TV show after this. Skilly unknown. Skilly explores the unknown parts. Okay, it's not going up as much anymore, and I feel like I covered all the text. What am I supposed to do here? Just running around the outside? Hit there, said time zones hurt my brain. Yeah. You opened one gift on the 25th, the night before Xmas. Okay. What does it read? It seems to be some sort of spell. The letters are unfamiliar to me, so it is hard to decipher them clearly. Why don't you ask the sea people? There must be someone who has knowledge of uh, crypto, cryptography or spells. But okay, I'll take it to me. I'll get right on that. An ancient spell that even Dr. Bacon cannot decipher. Hmm. I remember seeing many old books in the sea people temple. Uh, Nemo may be of help. All right. <laughs> Good shit. It's my Yeah, it's still working. Alright. Woo! Got some good stuff out of that dive. That was a very successful dive. Wrap up your day and get things ready at Bacho Sushi. Alright, hold on. Weather app. How close are we to the dredge stuff? What is it? Oh, we still gotta finish today, tomorrow. Fuck, dude. Alright. Did we finish any of this? No no no. Let's check on our little fucking... Okay, he's sick. We gotta make him better. I can't heal him at nighttime. Okay. Fine. You can just stay asleep and stay sick. Um... <laughs> capture near the boat. Do I have to capture... Today is Sunday. 
Oh, I can capture it on Sunday, right? Okay, we'll we'll leave that we'll leave that there for now. Uh, I guess I don't need to do a night dive. We want to progress time as quickly as possible. So we want to get to the dredge stuff, dude. Buckethead Zombie Gaming, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Parrot fish is in the shallows. Yeah, I thought it was at the boat rack, but I wasn't sure. <laughs> Who is this? Hello, everyone. This is Yui from NDC Station. Hello. Good to see you again. I'm Vincent Yamiko. Hello. Here he is, appearing out of nowhere again. What? The previous episode of Challenge the Chef was as hot as molten lava. It was truly an interesting development. Hello. And in today's episode, a new challenger appears. Hello. Let me introduce you to Alex Cooper, Cooksta's platinum ranked chef from the United Kingdom. Hello. Ah, you must be the sushi chef who beat Wang Peng in the last competition, yes? He kind of looks like uh, Ryu from Street Fighter. <laughs> I expected a fancier restaurant than this. Your establishment is humble indeed. Oh, the challenger is provoking the champion. This will be an exciting match. Today's theme is Fry the Sea. Both Japan and the United Kingdom are popular for their fried dishes. Their dishes may look similar, but are authentic each in their own way. Whose dish will please the palate of Vincent the judge? Can you guess the winner? My mouth is watering already. Haha. <laughs> what? Like before, we will give you two days. I repeat, you have two days to compete. What? Dear audience, this match will be fire. <laughs> Stay tuned and see what transpires in today's Challenge the Chef. All right, we got two days to get a great Look, my dinosaur guy, Raptor, he's got like, he was like, oh no. <laughs> now, dude, he totally is supposed to be Street Fighter. You see that little thing? Woo, this... It is an easy one this time. Your fried sea brim or black tiger shrimp will win the day easily. My choice is deep sea fish. Oh, why? They are well-known recipes, and I don't want to just replicate the taste. I took up the kitchen knife to explore new ingredients and the taste of the sea. The flesh of deep sea fish is unusually soft and gelatinous. I will fry it and harden it to add flavor and texture. But you're not familiar with deep fish recipes. What if Vincent doesn't like your dish? Don't worry, I will cook the best deep sea dish. Today's main ingredients are cookie cutter sharks, vampire squids, and binocular fish. The lineup is quite ambitious. While I trust your hunch, Pancho, I will try to secure them. All right, we have cookie cutter. We have it all, baby. We got it all, dude. Look, I am so good. We completed the quest before we even started it. Good shit, yo. <laughs> All right, we already have it. So we just have to wait the two days and not serve those fish. <laughs> so I can't serve those fish at the restaurant. But besides that, we're good. I should be able to research some new stuff, dude. What's the most expensive thing that I can research? $3.90 fried tomato and snail fish? That might be the one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it right there. What's up? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. KS Plays, welcome. Good to see you as well. Thanks for joining. All right. Research has been completed. Good shit. All right. We need more artists and flames to do more. Uh, staff wise, no, I need to save money. I need to upgrade my harpoon gun and stuff. All right. Let's start adding shit. Uh, we're going to add more of the stargazer for sure. Auto supply that. What else do we have here? Sea grapes, jellyfish. Yeah, why not? It's expensive, but it says. Auto supply. Uh, the Greenland shark meat. We can enhance that, baby. Let's do it. You'll have to catch up later with the VOD KS plays. Hey, no worries. Thanks for stopping in and supporting. I appreciate it. Drop a like on your way out if you don't mind. I would appreciate that. That helps out. All right. That might be one of the coolest. I really like it. Mm. Mooney Tooney, the, the small little cutscenes like this are fantastic in the game. I agree. All right. Definitely putting that on the menu. Auto supply. Uh, Mega Mouse Shark Meat. We should be able... To, oh, my God. To enhance it is so much, though. Let's not do that because I want to keep a lot of that. All right. Uh, yeah. And then auto supply. We need two more dishes. All right. Oh, let's do more. 
how much enhanced narwhal? Let's do it. Let's enhance it. And then put it on the menu, auto supply. We've only got six for Beagle. Um, yeah, let's put it. And I didn't put anything that we need for the... Yeah, I didn't put anything that we need for the... I didn't put cookie cutter, shark, vampire, squid, or barrel eye on there. And we didn't use... Did I use anything with kelp? I don't think I did. I'm looking over at the right to see the ingredients. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't use anything with kelp. All right, let's open. All right, here's the thing. I gotta get better at drink pouring because my two servers don't 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 do tea and stuff right now. So I I, I gotta do those and I gotta do them good. Like I gotta I gotta get better at this. Hey! <laughs> Hey, look at me go, baby. Good shit. Oh, fuck, I fucked. Oh, no, I did it. Oh, what is that? Oh, fuck, I fucked. All right, all right. I don't understand. Okay, I don't think I've ever gotten perfect on a beer. I'm not 100% certain how to do that. All right, let's just not do the thing I normally do. Bad, okay, too much fun. All right, understood. Damn it. There, that ruined our, five, our potential five star for tonight. Crushing it, dude. Raptor is the man when it comes to serving. Glad I hired him. Is that good? That's good. It's not perfect, though. Okay. As little foam as possible, right? Huh? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No! Oh, no. We had a customer leave. That's bad. How was this supposed to do? I need a server that also does drinks, bro. I need a server that does drinks. 7,800. 4.6. All right, that might be the most money we've ever earned. It was not good that that customer left pissed off. Misty said, Raptor is a phenomenal worker. He's one of the YouTubers I watch, and his character is epic. That's awesome. I'm going to have to check out. I had never heard of him until this. I'm going to have to check out his channel. It's party day today. Prepare the right ingredients to make a fortune. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I have shark meat. I need to catch more sharks. All right. Hold on. We need to finish this day quick. Because Monday night, the next day in game, Monday night, dredge. Dredge content, baby. It's what we've all been waiting for. All right, Bacho Sushi has a new family. I will take good care of them both. It's Momo. Kitty cat. All right, let's check out our guy. He's sick. We got to make him better. He's better. All right, he's hungry. He needs to eat. He's actually bigger than the food he's eating now, which I feel like is important. I don't know that you should eat food that's bigger than you. I mean, size-wise, not, not your, you know what I mean. All right, let's play real quick. Hey, what's up, Coast Ally? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Oh, fuck. Chat, where's it at? Chat, where's it at? <laughs> I, I, was, I was reading chat. I didn't even think about it. I, I honestly have no clue. Left, middle, or right? Shit. Fuck. I'm getting antsy, guys. I might accidentally just hit a button. Anybody? Is anybody in chat paying attention? Uh-oh. Nobody? Okay. Center. Fuck. It's the first time we failed. I wasn't paying attention, though. <laughs> Alright, I got it. I got it this time. It's on the right. <clears throat> Alright, he's good. Get out of here. Can I upgrade anything? I have 13,000. Ooh. I got 13,000, baby. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade my harpoon. For sure. Ah, air might be nice, too, to go to 370. But harpoon, baby. 40 damage. Super alloy harpoon gun. Dragon bite harpoon gun sounds so much cooler, though. Alright. Oh, it's at max. Okay. 
40 damage. All right. Uh, we need to find the parrotfish today. Um, what are our other quests real quick? This is it, right? We need to find the parrotfish. We already have everything for the VIP mission. Uh, we need one more cookie cutter, but there's no time limit on that. And we need to go to the sea people to progress, but I don't know that we're going to do that today. Uh, the parrotfish is in the shallows, right? Near the boat wreckage, so we're going to go down there first. We're going to get that out of the way. Carmel Acord said, don't forget to save up for the egg thing for the chicken farm. You are correct. I need 17,500. That might be a way later goal, though. I'm going to be honest. I would rather personally, I don't know, guys, if you feel differently in chat, let me know. But I would rather have Dave upgraded, like, my air and my, um, like, my cargo capacity and all that first personally because that's how we get all of our money right we can still get eggs without that thing it just makes the egg harvesting and stuff easier all right there's a more eel right there he should don't come out i thought they came out i gotta wait till he comes out to hit him. i know that Sorry about that, guys. Uh, I need air. Shit. That fuck. That. Oh, fuck. That really messed us up. How, did I, how the fuck did I do that? <laughs> oh, you know what I did? I might have accidentally hit my foot pedal. Oh, yeah, I think so. I need air, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no, dude. We see your way screens. <laughs> Thanks, guys. It's a good thing I looked at chat sooner rather than later. I need to find some fucking oxygen, though, bro. 66, please tell me where the goddamn air is. I need air. Get away from me. There has to be air somewhere. I'm wasting it sprinting, but I, I gotta find it. It's telling me the parrot fish. Oh, dude. All right, all right, we have a reset. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh, it's all gravy. It's all gravy, baby. Is it the boat like right down here somewhere? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there he is. All right, capture him. All right, I need ammo. Fuck. All right, I can't hit him from the front, remember? shotgun now i gotta dodge him because he has that bone thing on the front right so i can't hurt him from the front all right oh he hit me though fuck this is yep can't hit him from the front i gotta get him from the back Dumb bitch! Cat, good. Captured the fish bond. I can take it to Udo. Good shit. We got it. All right. <laughs> this dive is... <laughs> this dive has been something. <laughs> Jed Lyle said, did I really want to get rid of you guys that much? No, I'm just clumsy. And I accidentally hit my foot pedal. And I have one of my foot pedal things set to... <laughs> set to do that. That's what he said. Yes, that is what I said. I did say hit it from the back. <laughs> I 
gonna swear that was unintentional. All right, you know what? You fucking yeah, that's what you get. Hey, you want some too? And yeah, yeah, yeah. What now, bitch? Oh, we got cat. Hey, we got cat food. All right, we got our ammo back. All right, what else do we need? I need a cookie cutter shark, which they're in the depths. So why don't we go down to the depths and then we'll see if we can hit up the sea people too on this dive. I want to do this stuff quickly though, because I want to get to the I want to get to the dredge stuff, because I personally really want to see it and I want to see it for you guys too. where the cookie cutter sharks are. What is this guy? Have I caught this thing before? Come here. Come here. Get your, get your ass here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Tough, huh? Gotcha. What are you? Oh, we've gotten giant trollies before. I'm actually surprised I survived that. Wasn't pretty, but I survived. All right, we need to get down. We need to go down, down. Hey, what's up, buddy? I, uh, I'm not fighting you, I'm sorry. I'm after cookie cutter sharks. Take you back because you big. We also have that Shark Day event coming up, so today, right? Bye bye. Tiger Shark. There we go. We've gotten him before, though. All right, we've used. I've used all my scooter. Okay. Cookie cutter sharks are those really thin sharks down here, right? I believe so. Ooh, shotgun ammo over there too. I was getting chomped there for a second. 
All right, we're looking for those really thin, long cookie cutter sharks. I just need one more to complete that Sea People quest. That is a big mouth, mega mouth, big doohickey, whatchamacallit. Okay, okay. I am destroyer of sharks. I am like, ah, oh. dude, it's so good against the sharks. Morgan with the fifteen dollar Morgan P with the fifteen dollar stream elements donation said, "Merry Christmas! Thank you for all the awesome content and live streams." Morgan, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. You're a legend. Morgan is also a channel member. I believe, if I remember correctly, you're at the highest level, the squadron level, aren't you, Morgan? So, you're a rock star. Hey, thank you so much. All right, always disassemble, right? We get fragment parts. Todd Monster, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Good to see you, dude. Merry Christmas and happy holidays to you, too. Whatever you celebrate. Welcome, dude. Appreciate you joining. We got our flashlight. Sometimes I feel like the cookie cutter sharks are on the lower level of the depths. Sometimes there's that one chilling near the Sea People Village entrance, kind of. I always do this. I did it again. This is where you first meet the Sea People, and I don't need to be here. So we're going to take this water. Hey, what's up, Xantia? Welcome. Good to see you. Thanks for joining. I hope you're doing well. All right, we gotta go down the other way. It's over here. What's up, masked man? Welcome to the stream. Good to see you. I'm gonna be jiggling my Christmas bells tonight when we go to the hockey game for sure. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Need a little bit more light. Oh, no. All right, charge up. There we go. Ow. Oh, God, I got stuck in there. That didn't work out too well. Hey, that's a cookie cutter shark right there. No, me, me, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. That's a cookie cutter shark. It is. I think. Yeah! <laughs> I did it. All right, let's, uh... Ooh, I'm... I'm overweight though 95 kilograms so we might not be hitting the sea of people village this go round. we might just have to find a place to get us back to the surface what's up roman the unique welcome to the stream good to see you again all right we got a lightning harpoon level three good shit Ammo. Get whatever's in here. I'm swimming so slow. Rubber chicken? Nah, I want to keep the Japanese sword. The rubber chicken is funny for gags, but I want to keep the sword. All right. We need to find one of those escape pod radio port things because I don't want to drag this out. We're going to go back through here. We want to get to the dredge content, hopefully. I've only probably got like another hour, hour and a half that I'm going to stream. So I want to see the dredge stuff. I want to see the dredge stuff. got this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting smarter with the flashlight too, dude. There we go. There's our way out right there. Right there. We accomplished our objectives. Coast ally. Uh, it's, I, <laughs> it's not like, uh, NHL level. It's, uh, it's a local regional thing. I can't say who it is. Otherwise I will tell you exactly where I live. So, but I was completely okay that you asked, but yeah, it's just a local regional hockey league. So, but it's fun. They, it's really, I've been to like, uh, I had season tickets one time. It's just a lot of fun to go to. And so we're taking the kids tonight. It's going to be a, it's going to be a ton of fun. 
so nothing too fancy. The readership will go crazy over this. I'm excited to see how many of the upcoming issue will sell. How many of the upcoming issue will sell when it's published Monday morning? When the issue's out, we'll bring you a fee for your work. Please keep up the good work. Um, well, if there's a fee I'm getting for this, this might be a serviceable weekend side hustle. Good shit. All right. Oh, my, my thing. I was like, what's making that noise? It's this little guy. He's, he needs a lot of stuff. All right. Are you hungry too? You're like a full-time job, dude. This is crazy. When are you going to grow up into like something big and cool? I want you to be like one of these big sharks. Are you still hungry? No? Nope. Okay, you're good. All right, let's play with you to get the affection all the way up. Over here. A chain. Yeah. Oh, I did. I accidentally hit display. <laughs> oh, I can. We pleaded. I completed the research. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. All right. Oh, I also deliver this. I, I, there's a lot of research down here I completed and I didn't even realize. Good shit. 50. We're getting up there. Starfish. There we go. There's a lot of stuff I've been collecting. Oh, hey, another one. Level four. We got an eco gemstone bracelet. Okay. I wonder what that does. All right. We still have quite a few research tasks 640 points what is the look at my inventory all right right now we have the dolphin necklace the pink dolphin necklace increased speed by 30 percent and we have extra 50 percent of gun base damage added what is that eco this is the one we just got increases the amount of mineral acquired by mining yo i just saw chat seemed like it was popping off at the side oh yeah if it was nhl i would tell you because it would be big city yeah unfortunately i don't live near any nhl teams i would love to go to an nhl game sometime though you're a bruins fan for the nhl hey i don't really have a i don't i don't get i don't pay that much attention to hockey i don't have a specific team that i would root for in the nhl since there's not one close to me, so that's okay. So we can still be on good terms. <laughs> Allows you to travel through two worm tunnels. Okay, see people necklace, uh, increase poison, survive with a certain period after running out of oxygen, reduce damage taken by 10%, use dash for a short distance, increase the base damage of a harpoon gun by 15%. Hmm. I feel like I'll do the harpoon gun one instead of the octopus, right? Because I use you use the harpoon gun more, and I feel like I might want to make a special rifle with the gun guy real quick, if I could still do it, like upgrade the rifle. You might want to do the flame rifle, yeah. my god all right now i should be able to <laughs> so stupid man so fucking dumb i love it yeah that's gonna be my that's gonna be my gun right now can you change you can't change your harpoon gun can i change my melee weapon no okay all right um we've done everything there to do list what do we got we got everything for that we got the cookie cutter we just need to turn it in and we need to go to the sea people and show the slab okay and then we have the shark event and we're just waiting until tomorrow night for the dredge content. Okay, I'm going to go straight to the sea people then. Hey, take care, Fizzy Queen. Have a good one. Thanks for joining. Cass, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Good to see you. You're from SoCal and a born and raised Ducks fan, but still a Bruins girl too. You're all over the place. Hey. You, you, you like who you like. I don't have any problems with it. Oh, there's a cool. Why is there a question mark back here? Something I'm supposed to do over here? Oh, this is the guy I'm supposed to talk to about the tablet, right? I think. So let's do that. Let's progress the main story. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm glad that you cleared the path to the glacial area. No, this is not the guy I was supposed to talk to about that. I was able to get some seaweed seeds. Check these out. You can cultivate them at Gumo's farm. All right. Oh, good shit, man. Thanks for the seeds, dude. I appreciate that. You're a legend. All right, get out of here. All right. Does your oxygen... My oxygen doesn't go down when I'm in the village, right? Because I'm boosting right now and it's staying at 315. And usually when you, you use your speed boost thing, it lowers. All right, let's turn in our uh, cookie cutter shark quest. Now we got 50 money, so we have some money again. There's a new mission. Get ten or three aqua aquamarine. So minerals. I don't have the ability to get those yet, but we'll accept the request. All right. And then it looks like the workshop guy has something to say. Okay. <laughs> Dunwa, right? Is that his name? Dunwa. Dunwa, yeah. Coughing. Dua, your cough seems to have gotten worse. Are you all right? Yes, it's just a cough. I'm feeling much better than I was before. Coughing? He's coughing too much. I should ask Mima if there's any foods that are good for coughs. Okay. So we have a new mission for him. Uh, workshop, dude. I don't have enough to buy anything from you. All right. What's up, redhead playa? Welcome. Good to see you again. Appreciate you joining. All right. There's something on the second level. And we can talk to the farm guy. So let's talk to the farm guy. Then we got to head up to the second level. Which we got to go to the big mirror to do that, right? All right. He's got new seeds for sale because of that. That's good. What about the farm? How's the farm doing? Man, I can get my kelp and stuff. And then we got more stuff to plant. And I will... I need to buy a seed from you to plant in that other one. Let's, uh, let's get more black cor coral. Cor coral. 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 These people are people, Carl. Anybody know that, uh, meme for, uh, whatchamacallit? Walking Dead? All right, we need to go to the big mirror to go to the top. You gave the dog a cheeseburger? I mean, that's a good start. That dog's gonna be your friend forever. Wait, now it's telling me there's something down there. There's something... Oh, yeah, I gotta go to the restaurant and ask about recipes. That's right. But I gotta do the thing up here first. It's bigger than you and it's just sitting there staring at you? I mean, it's not like licking its lips and staring at you, is it? Because... I'd be a little worried if it was. I mean, you did feed it, so that's good. <laughs> Huh, Suam? What are you doing here? Are you reading a book? Huh, are you surprised? My keen analytic abilities come from the books I read. Oh, long time no see, human. I was sorting books. How can I help you? Can you take a look at this picture? It looks like an ancient spell, but I can't understand what it means. Hmm. I can roughly understand it. There was this stone slab located. Where was this stone slab located? In front of a large closed door in the glacial area. I see, according to the book, there are three large doors in the glacial area. And inside those doors is a switch that will lead to the divine tree control room. I did an analysis and found that the earthquakes are caused by the divine tree control room. Activate all the switches and you will be able to access the divine tree control room. That's not going to be easy. How am I supposed to open the big door? I have materials referring to the door. Let me see. Here it is. You need to cast a spell to open the door. Um, but I don't speak the language of the sea people. Ah, of course not. Then why don't you bring Suam with you then? Uh, Suam, you say. Human, you can do nothing without me. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, it looks like you're in trouble. I will give you a hand this time. Okay. Oh, I am not sure about this. Best of luck to you, Suam. May King Long's protection be with you. Stop worrying about me. Just lead the way, human. <laughs> Suam, this trickster this guy who doesn't actually do anything but says he does stuff <laughs> hmm this must be the door well am i supposed to cast the spell and nemo taught me watch and learn human oh, i didn't realize it was going to teleport me here like right away 
Hey, what's up, Marky Sparky? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Thanks for joining. Good to see you again. That's a really weird dance, dude. There was some hip thrusting involved there. I don't know how I feel about that, bro. That's, uh, that's, that's... Mm. Wow, the door really opened. I am impressed, Suwim. Ah, uh, now you realize my greatness. You said it was a spell and you had to dance as well to open it? Oh, that is... I needed to dance to keep with the beat. <laughs> Got it. Shall we get inside and check out the place, Suwim? Uh, my waist hurts from the dance. Unfortunately, you have to go alone today, human. Shake's head. All right. Fuck it. Let's do it. There's a couple of things to open out here first, though. Level four flame harpoon. Let's go, dude. What are you? A weedy sea dragon. I'll take it, dude. Oxygen canister. Don't mind if I do. The music is so nice. The music is probably going to change, though, when we go in here. Whenever we go to a, a inside, like, a new little area, new region, yeah, it usually typically changes. Hmm. There must be a switch to operate the divine tree control room inside. My gut feeling is that this passage will cause me trouble, but I have no other choice. I need to be careful. First glacial cave. So there's going to be two more after this. Okay. A piece of strange rotating equipment is blocking my way. I think I can start it by myself. Aw, oh, shit, dude. What am I going to have to do here? Oh, the equipment is working and the stakes started moving. I must avoid them. Okay. Huh. Alright. I can do this. This doesn't look too hard. You can see where they're coming out. Yeah. Look at that. I'm a swimming legend, dude. I might not know how to swim in real life, but a Dave the Diver? Your boy's a pro. It's 
gonna, okay. I think this is it. Yeah, 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 it's got enough to pass. This is it, this is it. I did it. There we go. Good shit. Good, the ice is broken, time to go down. All right. Look at that, I did it. And there's air over, I'm gonna go ahead and take the air. Just in case. We're not that low on air. Yeah, but I'm gonna do it. Alright. Down we go. The music is pretty chill in here, too. We're getting close. We're at 500 meters. Oh, crap. Oh, dude, I missed. I'm gonna say catch some fish while we're here. Why not? contraption uh Nemo told me about all right good shit this music is totally giving you 2009 the xx if anyone remembers them the xx is that a band the dog ran through the house holy shit what is happening dude oh, okay Turn to the village and tell Tenzin about this. And I am hungry. Okay. Sure thing. There's nothing else down here. There's something over here. Yeah. Yeah. Black coral. Okay. 
And we just checked off another eco task. Let's get the air that's here. Why not? Because we're not going to come back here. His head opened up. Mind blowing. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Good one, Jin Lineal. You got a badum test for that. it you're calling your mom you feel like it was a setup <laughs> sounds like it it's a little freaky to have an animal or a dog that's bigger than than you oh i missed by oh, i was just out of reach dude just out of reach I gotta get back to the sea people village. But I feel like I should I should get some fish and stuff while I'm here. Now you know what? I wanna get to the dredge stuff. We gotta we gotta we gotta we gotta move it move it along. Oh, uh oh. We don't wanna fight that guy. We don't wanna fight that guy. I just looked at my phone real quick. I'm sure he's not still here because he's he's got family stuff to do. But IGP earlier at the beginning of stream, he was calling me to tell me to unmute my mic. I remember I told you guys that he also texted me in all capital letters and said, unmute your mic. <laughs> I appreciate him looking out for me. I know you guys in chat were trying to tell me too. <laughs> I just saw the text. But I was like, oh, I have a text and I opened it. <laughs> It's him. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Is this the tranquilizer harpoon level four? Good shit, dude. All right, we need to find one of those mirrors, though, to get out of here. We've completed the thing. Mayo, mayo. We got some mayo, bro. There was a, do you guys remember, anybody who played, was it skate? There was a skating game back in the day. Back in like sometime between like 2006 uh, to 2010 or something, there was a skating game and they had some sponsored achievements and they had an achievement uh, that was called Don't Be So Mayo. And it was like to pull off some custom trick that like the mayonnaise had sponsored. And I don't know why, but I remember it was on Xbox 360 too. I played it on. I, uh, it wasn't Tony Hawk's Pro Skater because those games had finished by that time, but um, I don't know why, but whenever I hear the word mayonnaise, I think about that achievement. It's so weird how your brain works sometimes. Yeah, don't be so mayo, bro. Is mayonnaise an instrument? Ooh, 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 ooh. Can we get down here? I use one of my oxygen tanks. We need to drop something to get down there, right? Hmm. Is mayonnaise an instrument? Don't be so mayo, bro. <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck that means. Like, what does that mean? How are you being too mayonnaise? Ow. I hurt myself. I hurt myself. Hey. I was fighting your bitch ass. Get back here. God damn it, the miss. Now, got you though. Oh, I got a, a three star one too because I tranked him and picked him up. Good shit. Hey, another oxygen container. Look at that. We gotta find a mirror. Food. Good shit, dude. I need out of this place. I want to get to the dredge stuff, man. Oh, we can't go in here. The current's too high. This is the wrong way. Goober said, I guess bland. Don't be so mayo. Don't be so bland. Huh. I like mayo. Like, on sandwiches and stuff. I don't have a problem with it. I like it. I don't dislike it. Does mayonnaise taste bland? I. What you said makes perfect sense to me. And if you were at to ask me to describe the flavor of mayonnaise, I would say, yeah, it does taste kind of bland, I guess. Like, that's the best word to describe it. But there are people who despise mayo. Like, they hate it. They hate eating it, right? 
Like I know, there, I know several people in my life who just can't stand fucking mayo. Um, if it has a bland taste, why do you think that is? Like it does have a bland taste. I think it does, but why do people hate it if it if it's bland tasting? Inquiring minds want to know. Anybody out there hate mayonnaise? Why? Is it the taste? Because yeah, it, do it doesn't really have like that strong of a taste. I go on the right way to get to a mirror. <laughs> Goober said, I love mayo. It's good glue for sandwiches. It is good glue for sandwiches. I like I like mayo. Depends which type you get, I guess. We use creamy and tangy mayo. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've had tangy mayo. I'm fine with tangy mayo. I don't typically buy it though. I don't know I don't I don't know why. I just usually I get like we get like olive oil mayo. That's what we get. Because it's supposedly like slightly healthier. And I already have a terrible diet anyway. Duke's Mayo is the only correct answer, by the way. Duke's Mayo is good. I will give you that, Coast Alley. That is a brand that I like to get for mayo. Food that's good for coughs. Yeah, Dua's coughing has worsened again. Sigh, I told him it was too early to start working. Tis. Back when I used to study cooking, I learned that horsehair crabs are good for coughs. Horsehair crabs. That's right, horsehair crabs. Haha. The problem is that they dwell in the glacial area and live in crevices between rocks. I knew there was something in those rocks, bro. And any record of how to catch them disappeared as the path to the glacial area got blocked off. Hmm, how to catch a horsehair crab. Otto used to be a diver. Maybe he knows. So I gotta go ask Otto. He's the farmer. You prefer mir Miracle Whip? But yeah, I don't... I like mayo, and if I'm getting a burger or something, or I have a sandwich, I typically put mayo on it. Um, but I don't think I have a strong preference towards Miracle Whip versus mayo. Like, I'll just get whatever type of mayo is out or around or we have, that's the type of mayo I'm gonna use. Oh, new mission, get, uh, kill four beagle sharks, okay. Reddit player said, I think all mayo is the same, honestly, yeah. So there, there's nobody in chat who hates mayo? Josh G said, I find mayo has a bit of an egg taste to it. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's made from eggs, right? I don't think, I don't taste eggs too much though, but I guess depending on how your taste buds are and everything, that would make sense, yeah. <laughs> Coast Ally coming out the gate swinging on the Miracle Whip. She said, Miracle Whip is the garbage juice of mayo and I will die at that. <laughs> the garbage juice, I love it. <laughs> ah. Where else am I supposed to go in here? Uh, oh, Tenzin's house. Okay, so I gotta go up top. You don't trust McDonald's or Wendy's when it comes to mayo? Huh, interesting. Yeah, I don't really think about it. I'm also one of those guys like, not that there's anything wrong with customizing your stuff, but like if I go to a fast food restaurant or I go to a restaurant, I typically, like when I order something, I don't make a lot of changes. Like I don't really change like, you know, condiments or toppings or whatever. I just kind of get it how it comes and eat it. I don't really have any, uh, I don't have a problem with any vegetable toppings or any like condiment toppings. So I just, I just, I'm just a, like, yeah, that's what it is on the menu, sure. I mean, there are things that I won't order <laughs> because I don't like them, but I normally, whatever I do like, like a burger or a chicken sandwich or any type of pasta dish or stuff like that, like whatever I like, typically I'm okay with how it comes. Hmm, Nemo told me the story that a vine tree control room is malfunctioning and that is causing earthquakes, yes. Yes, I need to operate three switches to enter the control room. I already activated one of them. Well done. I am ashamed of our people having to rely on you in this matter. Please don't be, the earthquakes are a problem for us too. I remember something, it was written in one of the ancient books. After some workers mutated into Gadians due to engineered Dash's schemes, my ancestors created switches to access the control room and scattered them in the glacial area. They created these switches to tighten the security. 
But they have turned into obstacles now, denying access to the control room. It's still cold, but the heat coming from the ground is melting the ice. Maybe the control room is overheating, causing the water temperature to rise. Stabilize the device and the water temperature will return to normal. I know it's rather impolite of me, but please hurry before our ancestral home is completely destroyed. There are two doors remaining. I will try locating them. Hey, we got some money. Ancient stone slab mission. Clean up plate. Clean up plate. You want to go boil some eggs and make some egg salad? Dude, I like, I love eggs. Eggs are like my favorite breakfast food. Hands down, they're delicious. You haven't found it yet? Where did you search? I searched the whole village, but no luck. Okay. Oh, what's going on, Ramo? Oh, Dave, hmm, I think the beluga has suddenly gone missing. If he's not in the village, he could have gone to the other side of the glacier passage through the open door. He has a very curious kind, you know? You didn't hide him, did you, human? Why would I? All right, I will let you know if I find him. Thanks. Nawag Awang, what are you doing? Go find the beluga. <laughs> She's like, get out there and do your job. <laughs> Hey, thanks for subscribing to the channel, Huff C. Welcome. Good to have you if you're here. Hillman, what's up? Welcome. Hillman, are you Warrior 7? You have the same icon. Did you just change your display name? I just realized that. Are you different? <laughs> All right. We got to go back up to the ship. I want to pass the day. You are Warrior 7. Okay, thank you. I realized that last night, but I never asked. <laughs> I meant to ask. It was actually an accident, but YouTube won't let me change it. It won't let me change it back for two weeks. Oh, shit, dude. That's a... Yeah, they do that with usernames. It's to prevent, um, like, bot issues. Issues with bots. It's like one of their measures to get... To prevent botting. Unfortunately, the bad people got to ruin it for all of us. <laughs> Damn. All right. So this is nighttime. No, it's evening. Can we go to the restaurant already? We might be able to. Let's finish this day off so that we can get to... He's sleeping. I can't heal him while he's sleeping, so I have to turn around. This thing gets sick, like, all the time, bro. He needs to... I don't know what he's doing over there, but he gets, he gets sick a lot. We gotta talk to Otto, too. All right, let's go do our... Let's go do our... Let's finish this day out so that we can get to the drench stuff, bro. I can only stream for, like, another 45 minutes, probably. Oh, shit. It takes so long to get to the drench stuff. Is this another new person? Holy shit, dude. Django. Hmm, is something wrong? Cold. It's too cold. Uh, this place averages at 27 degrees Celsius even during the evening. My whole body is aching. I'll freeze to death. You, is there anywhere I can plant some seeds? Seeds? Yes, when I was climbing a snowy mountain of some faraway country, a local cooked me a meal with some peppers. It warmed me up. I could conserve my heat. I mean, my health. I was able to reach the top thanks to that dish. The local gave me some pepper seeds. Here. Hmm, I'm still not sure. What am I supposed to make with this? One of my friends used to love this song that was inspired by Hot Pepper Tuna. Ah, he's talking about Sammy's song. He said just listening to the song warms him up. Can you cook me some Hot Pepper Tuna, please? I don't know what the ingredients are, but I'm sure that dish will warm me up. Hmm, let, let me see if I can plant these seeds first. Coughing, make it quick, please. I'm freezing here. So we have another VIP to cook for. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. Cuisine made with pepper. First, I should take this pepper seed to Otto. And since Sammy wrote the song Hot Pepper Tuna, he might know something about it. Then talk to those two first. Okay. There is so much going on in this game right now. There are so many things. All right. Um, this is, uh, this is the shark event, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we research anything? We can. What's the most expensive? Fried rice with Sally Lightfoot crab? Let's do it. Let's research it, baby. Uh, we 
we only have 3,000, so we're not training anybody. All right. Okay, shark meat, right? Today is the shark day. Right, so we want to we want to do all the shark stuff. We're gonna enhance this one time, the mega mouth. He's gonna do the sword thing, isn't he? I love this one. Yeah, man. Yeah, dude. Skillowet, I like it. Skillowet. Look at this glowing magical creation I have created. All right. <laughs> Remaining menu will be discarded after the restaurant closes. Auto supply. We got it. It is the shark day, isn't it? Is it not? I thought it was the shark day. Better be the shark day, dude. Is Does this fish count as shark? I don't think it does. Uh, we'll do the Greenland shark stuff. We cannot enhance, though. It was it was shark party day, so we got to do a full shark menu. That's the only way to rock shark day, right? Thresher shark. We're gonna enhance that. <clears throat> These are the oh the party items are marked, right? This is the little event, the little bow tie thing. Those are the ones that we got to do. We can enhance this too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Skilly, you ought to know better. So our entire menu should be made up of party items. Yeah, 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 yeah. So he does count this long fish thing. What's our next party item right here? Oh, the short fin, Makio. And if we enhance, he gets even better. Can we enhance one more time? Yeah, why not? All right, there we go. No, no, no. Just put one and then auto supply if we need it. All right. We have a full menu. That means we're going to make a ton of money. We have a full menu of this stuff. What's up, Irish tater salad? Welcome to the stream. I want some tater salad now, dude. I haven't eaten. I didn't eat. Uh, I had breakfast this morning, but I haven't had lunch yet. So after I get off here, I'm going to go stuff my face. All right. Let's open the restaurant. Let's do this shit. All right. Your boy is going to do good with pouring drinks tonight. I swear. I'm gonna I'm gonna try my best. Perfection, baby. Although people are gonna get mad because I'm gonna I, I got a lot to run between here. Oh that's bad. No, nope, I didn't do good. I didn't do it. Don't get mad, don't get mad, lady. Don't get mad. Keep glad. Perfection. Oh, there are so many beers. I'm bad at the beer. I'm bad at the beer. That one lady's gonna get too mad. She's gonna get too mad about her beer. Don't get mad. Don't get mad. Don't get mad. They're all getting mad. They all want beer. And it's only one day. Oh, no, dude. No, 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 no. no. Oh, stop. There's only one Dave. There's too much foam. There's too much foam there. There's too much foam. They're all getting mad. There's too much fit. Too many people are wanting beer. I gotta put a server back who does drinks, dude. This is too much. This is too much. This is too much. It's too much for the Dave. It's too much for the Dave. They're all getting pissed. They're all getting pissed. They're all getting... Dude, dude, calm down. Everybody calm down. It's too stressful, man. I've had so many customers leave. Terrible night. How am I supposed to serve 1,700 beers? Everybody wants beer. Jesus Christ. God, I need to clone myself. Oh, we did so bad. 8,500, 3.9 stars. That was terrible. Oh, man. We're failing. We're failing. <laughs> so, there's two. Everybody was ordering beer. <laughs> Josh said I will not calm down. <laughs> Sammy, hey, what's up, Dave? Mm, you seem a little down today, Sammy. I want to discuss something with you. Can you come to the chicken farm? All right, be there soon. 
Today is the day, guys. We got to get to nighttime. The fog sure is thick today. Never thought Blue Hole would see any fog. It's kind of creepy. Hello there. A wonderful Monday. Thanks to your help, we were able to get a special in the magazine we issued today. Please keep up with the good work. I'll be back on Saturday. He Weekly, new fish found. A thousand gold. Let's go to discovery of warrior parrotfish has increased magazine sales. Udo has sent you a monetary reward as a show of appreciation. All right, good shit, man. We got $12,000. Can we upgrade some stuff on iDiver? There's also watching the fireworks after a good meal. I'm in heaven. I thought I'd feel too bad for the thresher shark to eat it, but it looks delicious. I thought a zebra shark's stripes would look like a zebra's, but nope. All right, we liked everything. Let's check on our guy. We need to fix him up. Get him some medicine, get him some food. Feed your ass. How you doing, man? You need one more food. We gotta play with you a couple times. We got this shit, dude. I'm crushing it. All right, in the center. Okay, one more time. All right, good shit. All right, you're all happy, right? Training, he's getting there training-wise. Okay, good. All right, uh, we've probably completed some of these, right? All the green ones are ones we've completed. We've gotten research rewards. Look at this, guys. I'm a pro, I'm a pro player now. I'm pro. I'm so pro. See people artifact. Oh, no, I need more for that. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Uh, to do's. Oh, my God. We have so much going on. Talk to Sammy. Yep. Uh, talk to Otto at the farm. Talk to Otto. We have a lot of stuff to talk to Otto about. We got so many things we're hunting. Okay. Um, what was I doing? What was I doing? What was I doing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I have lots of monies. I was going to upgrade. We should do... Should I do air tank? Like I should do air tank, bro. The next one is eleven thousand. Jeez, I could also upgrade my cargo box. You know what? Why not? Balls to the wall. All right, good shit. We had a lot of upgrades right there. I need to save. It can't. I, we've done so much. All right, day thirty. <laughs> in game day 30 hey thanks for subscribing to the channel big cheese that's what i'm talking about dude get some big cheese going uh i appreciate it welcome welcome all right we are going to the farm that's what we're doing because we got to talk to otto for two days and we got to talk to sammy Josue, what's up welcome to the stream Good to have you. Merry Christmas to you. We got an egg. We also can probably... We can't harvest stuff yet, but we can clean up. Yeah, Otto. I'm gonna get to you in a second, bud. Calm down. Slow your roll, dude. Slow your roll. These are in water, so am I supposed to water them? No, you can't water them. Okay. I'm probably supposed to... Oh, that didn't take. I was probably supposed to water all these plants, though. I'll tell you that much. All right, let's talk to Sammy first. All right, what's up, dude? What is it, Sammy? Well, I'm preparing my new album, and I haven't done any live shows, so I'm a bit short on cash. Oh, I see. Shut out. I'd like to help you run your farm as a part-timer. What do you think? Part-time job? Yeah. Yeah, I'll help you harvest crops, sow seeds, and weed, and fertilize your field. Mm. Mm, that sounds pretty good. Yeah. Aha, I used to help my dad run his farm when I was a kid. I mean, that was a while ago, but I could still handle a part-time job. Work it all. Right, so how do we do this? Okay. Talk to me whenever you need an extra hand. You can even decide how many days you want me to work at your farm. All right, we can help each other out. Okay. Hiring Sammy, new content. From now on, you can hire Sammy to work on your farm. Sammy can harvest crops, sow seeds, and fertilize in weed fields. All right, let Sammy take care of your seeds and fertilizers. He will make farming much easier. You can select how to use fertilizer and the type of seeds plant. All right. Dude, I can't afford you, bro. <laughs> the sound of water and insects here feels like a beat sometimes, yo. I should make this into a song one of these days. Hip hop is not just about glamorous city life. All right, we've talked to him. We got to talk to Otto. What's up, Otto? Hey, you want to catch a horsehair crab? 
boobies. That's right. Apparently, they live in crevices, so it's hard to catch them with harpoons or nets. Uh -huh. Ah, of course you can. You'll need a crab trap. Mm. Crab trap? <laughs> yes, sir. You put some bait inside the crab trap, place it between some rocks, and crabs or lobsters will walk right in. Uh -huh. mm. Wow, then I could catch a horsehair crab with it. Do you have any? Oh. I'm retired, of course. I don't have one. Um, but I can make one for you if you have the materials. Mm -hmm. All right, what kind of materials do you need? Um, eh, some lumber, scrap iron, rope, uh, and you'll need a tiger shark tooth for a good grip. Okay, mm, okay I'll try to get everything for you. Mm -hmm. I think I have all of that except for the tiger shark tooth. Good, I gathered everything I need to make a crab track. I should go back to... Oh, I already have it. Okay, good. <laughs> Good, you brought all the materials for the crab trap. All right, time to work my magic. Let's see if I still got it. <laughs> Good shit. <laughs> Why did a chicken block right there? That's hilarious. So we got the trap. Well, this is crab okay. trap. Yes, sir. You put it in a crevice where there's a lot of bubbles and wait for it a bit. <laughs> when he catches crab, the crab trap will start shaking. You'll know right away. <laughs> Go. Got it. With this, I can catch horsehair crabs. Okay. Uh, different things live in different areas. So try to put that to good use. Good shit. All right. I have to talk to you about something else, too, I think. Let's look. Uh, find the missing beluga. We already have all the stuff for the next VIP. We need to talk to Otto about the pepper seed. All right. We need to catch horsehair crabs, just one. All right. So we need to talk to Otto about the pepper seed. All right. Otto, a customer gave me some pepper seeds. Can we plant it? Gasp. This is, this is no ordinary pepper. You brought me habanero seeds. Habanero? Yes, sir. The fifth spiciest pepper in the world. Can't even harvest it without wearing gloves. Still, it won't be difficult to grow here. Oh, then I should give it a try. We got a customer wrapped in thick clothes saying he feels cold even in this weather. All right. Sammy, do you know the recipe for hot pepper tuna? The customer mentioned your song and wanted to try the dish. I have a fan. I'm flattered. Yeah. Hot pepper tuna, the song, was inspired by a dish my mom would sometimes cook for me. My mom's pepper dish, especially your pepper tuna. It was the best. <laughs> Aha, I can still remember Sammy drenched in sweat, gobbling up every last bit. He would spend the entire next day in the toilet. <laughs> And then he would eat it again. Oh. Come on, Dad, you're embarrassing me. Anyhow, a recipe? I don't know the exact recipe, but I know what ingredients you need. That should be enough for Boncho to come up with something. Tell me. Mm. Mm, a habanero. I should get my hands on more of those seeds, haha. Uh -huh. All right. New recipe. Good shit. All right. Can we plant that then? Oop, I didn't mean to water. Let's plant our habanero seeds. And then we gotta water them. All right. Why? How did I use the... There we go. How does it say? Water? 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 And then I can buy one more seed from you and plants over here. Shop. Uh, let's buy an eggplant seed. We haven't planted a lot of eggplants. I'm gonna put that down. Water. Alright. That's all we needed to do here, right? believe so we got to find the missing beluga we got to wait for that to happen catch a horse here crab aquamarine and poor beagle sharks all right let's get out of here let's go back to the boat all right so i guess dive back to the glacial area see if we can't get those sharks right and we'll need to see about getting aquamarine we haven't been able to harvest them yet so it might just be we have to upgrade the knife but if we find a pickaxe, I don't know if it'll help. What's up, Drac guys? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Burr, it's cold. Oh, I said, human, your clothes look very warm. Why don't you go inside and take a look? Achoo? You are weaker than you look. <laughs> y'all better, y'all better leave me alone. All right, hold on. We got a new ingredient over here, I think. Or no, we already have this sesame seed. Good shit. Made lots of progress. Tonight's the night where the dredge stuff should happen. We got the thick fog. All right. We need to catch the crab. This is, uh, that's a poor beagle shark, right? So we need to do three of them. Oh, I, did I hit him? Or did I hit someone? Dude, he's so fast. Like this. 
teleport beagle shark per dive. So I doubt we're going to find another one, but we'll see. What's up, Jojo Rod? Welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Thanks for joining. It's a shock harper. Yes, please. Got that chill-ass music again, dude. What time is it? 3.31? Fuck. I'm going to get to the dredge content right at the end of the stream, and then I'm going to have to go. God damn it. It's taken two streams of progress just to get to the dredge content. Fuck. I think, though, once it's unlocked, like, once we have this first night of thick fog, like, it's always a thing then. So. Also, how long is this game? I remembered at the end of the last day of the Diver stream, not last night, but the one a month before, I was like, yeah, I think we got, like, two more streams left. <laughs> We still haven't even finished chapter six. Shit's crazy. This game has so much content. It's awesome. All right. Why is it doing that? Why is it not letting me? Oh, I have baseballs. I got rid of my knife for baseballs. What? When did they add baseball? I didn't even realize. I didn't even pay attention. I didn't realize I picked up fucking baseball. I'm gonna throw a baseball at a fish, dude. Look at this. I just hit a fish with a baseball, bro. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> That's great, man. It does have content packed inside of content. Yeah. Oh, shit. Fuck. I wasn't even... I looked at chat for one second. All right, we got to go to the other side. What else are we looking for down here? Fuck, I forgot. Uh, the beluga... And we need aqua, aquamarine minerals, which are right down there, but we don't have a high enough knife yet. We haven't found a pickaxe. We also need the two other control rooms, but I'm wondering if we don't need like a heat suit or something to be able to get those. Post Sway with the five gifted channel memberships. Welcome to channel membership, Coast Ally, Black Wolf CC, Kyle Rosell's, Austin Vance and Wrecking Nomad. Josue, you absolute awesome legend. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate that. Helps me out a bunch, man. Hey, we got more mayo. Don't be so mayo, bro. Don't be so mayo, man. Hey, there's a crab. I see bubbles coming from the crevice. I should place the crab trap auto made from. There's also a regular crab on top of it, though. You can now use crab traps. Put some bait in the trap and place it in a rocky crevice. Okay. Up by catching a crab, the crab trap will start shaking. Remember, unretrieved crab traps disappear when you leave the water. Make sure you retrieve them. Did I not put them as an item for me, though? All right. Merry Christmas to you, Osway. Appreciate it, man. Hey, it's the beluga! We found it. What's wrong? Is it sick? Is it hurt? Oh, no. This is the guy that takes you, quick travels you around the sea village. Oh, a beluga. Why is it here? Oh, it got poisoned by the octopus, I bet. Yeah. Oh, is this an Antarctic octopus? It's venom venomous, maybe poisoned. Yep. Okay. waggling at me. Ack you. Why you little? I'm not letting you go. Stop there. I'm gonna catch your ass, bitch. I gotta catch him. I gotta catch him. Hey. Hey. He, he tried. That little shit tried to icicle stab me. Get your bitch ass here. Nope. No, sir. I'm not falling for that shit. Right, son. Yeah, you ain't got nowhere to go now. 
What you gonna do now? Hans, I cornered this one. It looks kind of pitiful up close. No, I can't be weak now. I should show it who's boss. Should we harvest it or rescue it? Oh, shit, dude. I feel like if I don't harvest it, I can't save the fucking beluga. But I feel like I'm an asshole if I harvest it. I've already caught him before. Mooney Tune said rescue. Yeah. I've, oh, okay. All right. Costa. <laughs> I like Ghost Ally. You crack me up. <laughs> I'm, gonna <harvest. laughs> I'm gonna rescue it. <laughs> Most people are saying rescue. <laughs> It is Christmas. It is Christmas. Mm, what bottle is this? The octopus dropped it. Ghost Ally had the hard stance on Miracle Whip, too. <laughs> it's the worst of the managers. I love it, Ghost Ally. Oh, man. Mm, what is this bottle? The octopus dropped it. Antidote, perhaps? I should go back to the beluga. Okay, so I guess maybe I may... You probably get the antidote either way, right? I would assume. Cause you need the beluga back in the fish village for the for the transport. <laughs> Ghost ally is uh is uh is fucking no hold doesn't hold back no punches pulled I love it. Santa will give me a sack of coal if I don't save it. Yeah. I uh, I only get I'm a dad I only get uh, socks for presents anyway. Hey, well, <laughs> thanks for subscribing to the channel, Bone Melt Seven. Appreciate it. Welcome. Glad to have you. Where's this stupid whale again? Is it up here somewhere? No, 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 no. It's back down this way. I'm pretty sure it's back over this way and up some, right? I could be wrong about this. Hey, news. No, hey, listen. I like new socks too. Just saying. But as a dad, that's like typically the only thing you get. No socks this year if you don't rescue it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you don't look well. Do you want to try this? Yes, yes, give it to him. Save him. Make him no longer beleaguered. Because he's a beluga well. You guys get it? Beleaguered? Beluguered? Yeah. Oh, you look better now. I am relieved. Why don't you return to the village? You could get there alone, right? Yeah. He's shaking his little hump head. The, yeah, affirmative. Good shit, dude. Alright, now that I found the blue guy, I should explore some more. Okay. Yeah, mission complete, dude. Alright. I need fucking air, bro. I need R. Where's the R? Somebody give me some oxygen. Alright. Ooh, what is this? Sticky bomb gun. That's new. That one has a death-like grip. It turns the surroundings into a burning hellscape. That's a cursed soul. What? This is a new gun. We've never had that before. I think that was the new gun that we were missing. The drain gun is the new gun for the dredge content, but we haven't started the dredge content yet. But that's the last base game gun. All right. All right, I gotta set the trap. All right, well, once deployed, traps and bait cannot be retrieved. Uh, I'm gonna put the, the, the crab. I'll put the crab there as bait. I should come back later. It'll take some time until something takes the bait. Okay. All right. It'll be shaking when something takes the bait. I have to find food immediately, or food air immediately, like yesterday. Uh, Warrior asked, Skilly, are you doing a one-armed robber video? Saw Dre's go live this morning. Yes, I am. I'm gonna be doing a longer cut like I typically do. I think IGPs will be coming out soon too. Yes, the fish, the fucking fish. Yes. Um. But yes, I will. Oh shit. Oh shit. You know what? Sticky bomb gun, you. Uh, I need more time though to, to finish my edit. So, but yes, I will be doing one. It will come out probably sometime next week after Christmas. 
because tomorrow is Christmas Eve and then Monday is Christmas, right? And then I got plans tonight with the fam for the hockey game, so I won't be able to do it. And I promise, yeah, uh, of course, I'm not going to do anything on Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. That's going to be fully devoted to fam. So sometime, probably Tuesday next week, I will drop my one-armed robber video if I can finish it in time. You prefer my longer cuts? Oh, I appreciate that, man. Hey, I think my I think my thing is uh yeah I think the uh, fish is there. Also, we have 370 air by the way after upgrading. That's pretty fucking nice. Yep, we got some shaking, some shaking and some baking. All right, all right, we got a horsehair crab. I should take it to be me. Perfect. Let's go. We are definitely planning on doing more modded Lethal Company. I don't know when that's gonna happen though. We gotta record more. And with it being the holiday week, you know, we've all got family stuff going on, but that, that'll definitely happen. Those videos keep being one out of 10 for Dre, and they're usually pretty high up for me too, and they do well for IGP, so yeah, absolutely. <laughs> We're gonna go back to see people first. There's a lot more um, mods, too, that we want to add to Lethal Company, so you got that as well. All right. Whoa, a horsehair crab. How did you get one? I used a crab trap. You can lure them into the trap with bait. Yeah, I think I've read about it. Anyway, this is great. Horsehair crab is most delicious and nourishing when steamed. I have a steamer. I could cook it for you in no time. Haha, <laughs> here, allow me. You're heading out, Panthera? Hey, take care. Have a good one. 7 a.m. and you haven't been to bed yet. Holy shit. Well, get some sleep. Michael Cannon. Welcome. Good to have you. Thanks for joining. I appreciate it, man. I think you were here at the start. You've probably been here the whole time. Whoa. She steamed the hell out of that. Wow, you steam this crap to perfection and almost makes me want to eat it. Haha, uh -huh, make sure you don't. Here, come to the door so I can give it to you. All right. Here, I packed it up for you. Please give it to Dua. I absolutely will. All right, we got to go give this to Dua. Then we got to go check in at the other exclamation mark over here. Then we got to go back to the surface. We got to get it to nighttime so that we can at least end the stream because I got to go soon. At least end the stream with some with some dredge content, some dredge starting content. All right. Our people do not wield weapons except the guards, so this workshop mostly crafts production tools. You should bring the materials to land to create a weapon. All right, how do I give you the food, dude? Aren't I, aren't I supposed to deliver said food to, to you? Yeah, how do I give you the food? She just gave me the food, didn't she? That's Dua. All right, now hold on. Let me let me go talk to this guy because he's got an exclamation mark. That's Dua. Why am I not supposed to give him the food yet? That doesn't make any sense. Do I need to have the quest active to do it and I can't do that while underwater? Maybe. Where did it go? What happened, Guma? The manatee's baby, it just suddenly disappeared. Uh oh, that's a big problem. The manatee's mom is also worried. Things are getting out of hand. Do you have any ideas? Maybe it saw the beluga and went to the glacial area. There is kind of a suspicious place. I'll go check it out. Oh, thank you, human. I'll be waiting. Hey, Michael Cannon with the 20 gifted channel memberships. Welcome to channel membership. Mooney Tooney, Solar Motion, Cody Zane, Jason Phillips, Jackie Wells. Uh, for Tony, R U N, Jant J P, Nathan Farewell, da Dominigo. I'm so sorry, I butchered that. O'Shea, Curse Cherokee, Lauren Nail, The Six Swords, Winter Does Not Hold Us, Kavan Ost, Marco Antonio, Matthew Bridgman, Shield Z R F C. Welcome to channel membership, everybody. Michael, you absolute legend. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate that. You're a rock star. <clears throat> all the channel members everybody everybody gets a channel membership chats pulling it they're acting like oprah you guys are pulling channel memberships from out and under the chairs i love it thank you thank you all right i don't know how to get yeah like it has a thing here oh is it because i have another quest to deliver aqua aqua marine to him 
is asking, did we enjoy one-armed robber? Curious if y'all want to do more. I enjoyed it. I think the boys enjoyed it too. I'd love to do more. We didn't talk about it. I could definitely ask them, but I'd like to do more because there are more maps and stuff to unlock and do other places. Uh, it's also, if, for anybody curious, it's free to play. There's no microtransactions that I saw. So um, you could go download it on Steam for free and play it. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, I would like to do more. It's made by the same guys who did that one-armed uh, chef game that we played. I forgot what that was called. One-armed cook, I think. Yeah, yeah. Uh, one-armed robber is completely free. So yeah, yeah. All right. Boat area. Because I want to finish out the day, dude. Yeah, I think everyone is green now, too. It's awesome. By the way, if for some reason you don't have a channel membership or you haven't been gifted a channel membership, that's okay. Make sure that you have gifting turned on for the channel. So whenever somebody is generous again and gives out memberships, either this stream or another stream, you are in the running to get a channel membership because it's randomly assigned. Uh, I'm going to type it in chat, but if you type exclamation gifts. Oh, Drac Ice, you legend. Thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Uh, Drac Ice ty typed it there, but if you click on that link, it's going to take you to a new uh, browser window. If you're on mobile, it should do the same thing where it should pop up a little box and ask, do you want to allow gifting for my channel? And all that does is put you in the running for whenever people gift memberships. So make sure you do that if you haven't done it. Yeah, I appreciate it, Drac Ice. You're always on top of it, dude. Thank you. All right. That's the first time we've got the sticky bomb gun. We need to find it two more times, and then we'll be able to craft one of our own. So, all right. Good shit. So we have the afternoon. I really just want to skip to nighttime. I'm going to be honest, because I want the dread shit. <laughs> all right. Yeah, I think I have to have that mission selected for to be able to deliver stuff to him. So, um is why it didn't work. We've completed another thing, though. We need to check on our little guy. And then we need to get to nighttime. Oh, he's gonna turn into a dolphin! <gasps> it's a dolphin! Indo-Pacific bottlenose dolphin. Hell yeah, dude, let's heal him. Oh, he's so cute! He's actually cute now. Oh, he's not one of the rare ones, though. How do we get one of the rare ones? This dolphin has a long and balanced snout. Its back is dark gray and its belly light gray. It tends to live in groups. So if we accidentally kill our Gaio, do we get a new one and then we get a chance at getting another one of these? Because I want one of the two rare ones. Like, should I should I let him die? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> boop, boop, boop. Oh, no, he's not hungry. All right, play with him one time and then we're good. Oh, fuck, I missed it. Nope, I did it. Okay, good stuff. Uh, what's new in Eye Diver? Said something new. Oh, I can upgrade your crab traps. Mm, okay. All right. Kyo rewards. I don't know what that means. I don't know what the rewards are for that. Um, we do one more dive, right? Let's go back to the sea people and see if we can deliver the stuff to Duma now. Hey, what's up, Setch? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Thanks for joining. Coast Ally says dolphins are literally the scariest mammals in the ocean. Anytime as a surfer, if you see a dolphin, you swim for your life back to shore. They are vicious. Do they get mean? Are they territorial? I think they're territorial, aren't they? What's up, Denise? Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. Did I know dolphins once walked on land? I did not know that. Is that true? Is that a thing? Did they have feet? That's weird. Science is weird. Hey, thanks for subscribing to the channel. I can't pronounce your name because it's in characters that aren't English characters, so I apologize. But I appreciate it. It looks like the first character is an A. Thank you for subscribing. All right. Our people. Can I give you the food? Why can't I give you the food, dude? Take my food. Do I have to complete the other quest first before you take take the food? I want you to have the food! You son of a bitch! Dolphins are gnarly. 
gnarly. Orcas are like the biggest killer, right? Like orcas are dangerous, aren't they? I've always heard if you're swimming and you come across an orca, you need, you need to get away and you need to be very careful. All right, I'm just gonna progress to nighttime because I, I really should be getting off here. So I'm gonna, prog I'm gonna go back to the boat and we're gonna see if we can't end the day. I want the thick fog. I want, yeah, 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 yeah. I want to see the traveling merchant come. Hey, it looks like Dredge. It looks like Dredge. It's got the red right little stuff in his big little thing. The fog is even redder now that it's the evening. Well, how creepy. Huh, there's some light that's approaching us. Hey, it's the traveling merchant lady. From Dredge. <sighs> Phew, the fog is really thick today. Oh, who are you? I'm a traveler and a merchant. I'll roll it into one. I ended up here while I was out hunting for aberrated fish. Aberrated. Oh, you don't know, do you? Aberrations refer to sea species that have strangely mutated or changed in some bizarre way. They appear at specific locations on days when the red mist rolls in. There are creatures called hooded figures who feed on these aberrated fish. Uh -huh. If you bring them aberrated fish, they will compensate you well. Mm. I have no idea what you're talking about. Mm. <laughs> hooded figures are sure to visit a nearby restaurant during the evening. Oh. By the way, you seem like a fisher. In that case, can you help me catch some aberrated fish? Mm. What? I can't sail in this fog. <laughs> now, don't you worry. I'll lend you a special light that helps you sail through fog. Ah. It's called the sky fire. Hmm. You'll be able to navigate through the red fog with this, though you won't see very far. Haha, oh. <laughs> aberrant fish. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds fun. Oh. For now, we could use that light of yours. As it is, we won't even be able to reach Bonso Boncho Sushi. I like how the music changed. It's like all distorted and oh. shit. All right, now we should be able to navigate these waters. Oh, by the way, about the aberrant fish. Those hooded figures may eat them, but for sure, the regular guests won't. What we, should we do with the leftover fish, miss? <laughs> ah, I'll come and buy whatever's left once you close up shop. <sighs> After all, they'll go bad the very next day if you store them like any other fish. <laughs> well, if that's the deal, shall we give it a try, Dave? <laughs> aberrant fish, huh? Should be pretty interesting stuff for a diver like you. <laughs> I do want to see them, but I have a feeling they won't be easy to catch. Haha, <laughs> uh -huh, you've but you've got yourself a mighty harpoon. <laughs> For now, let's sail. Now I can control the ship too, I think. So that's part of the thing. Explore. I can drive the ship. This is new. We can move the ship around the blue hole. <sighs> I can drive. Mm, the fog is thick, Dave. Days like this can be a dangerous one. I recommend brushing up on how to steer the boat. Dude, we can actually move the boat! Good shit. And then we can rotate the camera and adjust the camera height, okay. I bet we can dredge too. Hmm. It seems like it's smooth sailing for you. There's one thing I forgot to mention. Where there's a small vortex, there's sure to be aberrant fish. Hmm, a small vortex. Oh, and you'll see some spots foaming with bubbles. It won't be easy diving in those areas, but there's valuables you can dredge in those areas. You might find rare materials or items that will fetch a good price. Keep an eye out for them. Valuables. Now that's something we can't miss. Ha uh, Talk to you later. See you at the restaurant. Dude, if they add... Dave the Diver DLC to dredge eventually and it allows you to dive. That would be so fucking dope. During foggy evenings, you can catch aberrant fish. Move your boat to find a dive spot. Good shit, dude. We're actually traveling around. Oh, this is so oh. cool. This is such a great addition. There, that looks like the small vortex that the merchant okay. mentioned. It looks like it. Ready to go in, Dave? Oh, mm, it looks even more dangerous up close. Oh. We can't come all the way here only to leave empty-handed with your skills there shouldn't be any problems now let's catch some aberrant fish let's do it dude dive all right i gotta do this dive and then i gotta go <laughs> unfortunately but we've unlocked the dredge content so next time we do dave the diver which will be sometime this coming week after christmas we will explore all of the dave stuff Finally, promise.
All right, there should be aberrant fish here somewhere. Ooh, grenade launcher. Flash grenade launcher. from Dredge. That's pretty badass. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is some of this. What do we got over here? I like how they added the Dredge effect to the fisheye effect when things are fucked up in Dredge. That's really cool that they added that. Grotesque mackerel. Look at that. That thing looks wicked, dude. That looks so wicked. We're gonna catch a bunch of these. Yeah! You ain't no match for Dave, buddy. Oh boy, Dave. Let's keep going down, though. Let's see what else we find. <gasps> Another fanged gun. This is such a, like, match made in heaven and a great idea for DLC. I'm so happy that the two devs partnered for this. Such a... It's fucking fantastic. I wish more devs would play nice like this together. Can you imagine all the awesome crossovers? We have many-eyed macro. You see all those fucking eyes on that thing, bro? Not okay, dude. Not okay at all. All right. I saw another weird-looking aberration down here as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's this? Oh my god, it's got three heads. Is that the three-headed, uh, oh, that, yeah, yeah, I recognize this. I forgot, it's the three-headed cod, right? Yep, three-headed cod. I called it, baby. Called it. Yeah, yeah, you don't see dev teams teaming up like this for stuff. It's really cool that they did it. All right. music too it's like somehow they took like because uh dredge has really good music too they took like dredge and dave the diver style music and they somehow meshed it together where it's got the creepiness of the dredge stuff but it's still got like that chill undertone best better yet this dlc is free reminder this dredge dlc for Dave the Diver is free if you own Dave. Grotesque mackerel. Oh, yeah. That's really cool, too. They're not even charging for it. That's just, it's insane. All right. Come on, come on. Good shit. Another fanged con. It does have more chill lo-fi vibes. Absolutely. <laughs> we have 125 kilograms of storage now, which is really nice. I don't want the baseball bat. Ooh, the mini-eyed fish. These things are fucking creepy, dude. There's some big, uh, there's some shark aberrations and some bigger creature ones, too. I don't know that we'll encounter any on our first dredge dive here, but... There was one shown off in the trailer for the game. Top five games of 2023. Man, I'll tell you, Dave is up there. Dave and Dredge are up there, definitely. Resident Evil 4 Remake. So yeah, probably Resident Evil 4 Remake, Dave the Diver, Dredge, and there are two more. What else did I play that was amazing this year? I'm trying to think, Alan Wake. I don't know. So I think Alan Wake is great, and it's shaping up that it would be on my list. Um, I just haven't finished it yet, so I feel weird about including something that I haven't finished yet. But if it, if they don't drop the ball with the ending and it stays the way it is, Alan Wake 2 would definitely be on there. And then what else? What else have I played? Tears of the Kingdom. Tears of the Kingdom. Absolutely. Hands down. God, though, dude, Tears of the Kingdom, um, yeah. That eel was fucking weird. Oh, oh, shit. Yeah, 
Yeah, so that would probably be it. It would probably be Dave the Diver, Dredge, Resident Evil 4 Remake, Alan Wake 2, and Tears of the Kingdom. As long as Alan Wake 2 doesn't drop the ball. If, if Alan Wake 2 drops the ball or gets worse, which everything I've heard says it doesn't, but if I don't like the ending or the last fourth of the game that I haven't played, then I would replace it with something else. I kind of like Lords of the Fallen. I might, I might say that. Although, hold on. What else? I'm trying to think in my memory. What else? What else came out? Yeah, Tears of the Kingdom would probably be my top. Then it would probably be Resident Evil 4 Remake. Then Dave the Diver. Then Dredge. And then I'd probably put Alan Wake 2. Grouper? Dude, they, I think they put like most of the aberrations in the game, it seems like almost. Which is pretty cool. And they didn't get fine. Look at this. Look how far down we're diving. They didn't make the dive areas for the dredge content. They didn't make it like a small little area. It's like, it seems like it's like the full game. Oh, we got a big one. We got a big one. That's a perfect way to end. Good shit. That's a perfect way to end this dive. Dive? Look at that fucking thing, dude! Fuck that, dude. Oh! Bro. Hey, hey. Hey, you need to chill the fuck out, dude. Oh, shit! Got him. Got him. Hell yeah, dude! Look at that fucking thing, dude. Oh. That and those eyes. If you were down and you saw something with eyes like that and teeth, a sallow saw. Oh, oh. No, thank you, dude. No, thank you. Oh, that didn't kill him? <laughs> Holy shit. Good shit, good shit, good shit. All right, we're gonna capture this. This is the last new one. And I'm gonna head back up. Dude. They did a really good job with the models, too, dude. The model, I don't know why that wasn't going up. I might have accidentally been spinning it the wrong way. Oh, did it die? It died from poison. Post eel. The models are really good. I, I dare say they look just as good, if not maybe better than dredge. That's not even all the dredge content, guys. We haven't encountered a lot of the big aberrations. We haven't encountered a lot of little. We haven't sold items. We haven't dredge. We haven't done the actual dredging yet for rare items. We haven't served the hooded figures at the restaurant yet with this. There's still a tons more dredge content. Wow, that was some dense fog. Sure was. Good thing you made it back. Uh, did that merchant lady mention something about hooded figures coming to the restaurant? Let's go to Bancho Sushi. All right. It is 404, though. I'm going to have to save that the next time. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to play Dave the Diver again soon, though. Because I want to see the rest of this. But I got to go. I got to go. I got to eat. Got to get ready for the hockey game. Hey. I appreciate everybody joining today. It was awesome. Thank you guys so much. Listen, Merry Christmas. If you if you celebrate Christmas, I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas. If you don't celebrate, happy holidays. Have a happy new year. I will be streaming again before the new year. Sometime after Christmas Day during the week, I'll do a couple streams. I'll have a couple videos come out here and there. But I really appreciate everybody. Thanks for all the gifted memberships, all the donos today and everything the last couple days. You guys are awesome. So have a safe, happy holiday, whatever you celebrate, whatever you do. Enjoy the time with family and friends. Be awesome. Stay awesome.